Hello everyone and welcome back to GDQ Hotfix, your source of speedrunning content all the time, every day. And here we have It's Dangerous to Go Alone, which is a celebration of cooperative speedruns. Before we get started with our run for today, which is Untitled Goose Game Co-op All Items, I have a handful of announcements for you all. If you enjoyed Frost Fatales, which I absolutely did, March 26th, we're going to have the Frame Fatales Game of the Month celebration on GDQ Hotfix. We're going to showcase all the games the women of the Frame Fatales server have been learning every month since 2019. And you can go to gamesdonequick.com slash framefatales for more information about the group in general. Summer Games Done Quick has been announced. You can find more information about the dates, submissions, and all the things that you need to know about SGDQ at gamesdonequick.com. Calm. And your subs, gift subs, Prime Gaming, and Bits help support our weekly Hotfix content, so please consider supporting our daily shows if you enjoy Hotfix. So, uh, remainder of the week, you can check out tomorrow at 7 p.m. Eastern, we have Awfully Silly, which is a show about awful and silly games, followed by That's Never Happened Before, which is a show about explaining glitchy speedruns. But now I am super duper excited for us to jump on in and of course, get your honks ready in the chat. We have Untitled Goose Game, co-op all items with our runners, Tasselfoot and Thundar001. How are y'all doing today? Honk? Honk. Doing honk. well. Honk. <laughs> doing honk, absolutely. And uh, also we have Ritz Blues here on commentary. How's it going? Quack, I mean honk. <laughs> uh, how's everyone doing? Okay. Yeah. Uh, thank you for the introduction, Court. Uh, I am Tasselfoot here with Thunder. Uh, this is, she said, is co-op all items. Uh, Thunder and I have both been speedrunning Goose Game for like a really long time. Myself since the day it released. Uh, this is a long run. We're gonna just start things off, and then we will explain way more than you ever wanted to know about uh, two angry geese. So I guess with uh, with no further ado, we'll we'll count it down and we'll go on first honk in uh, we'll say five, four, three, two, one, honk. Honk. All right. Good luck. So yeah. So this is co-op all items. What does that mean? Uh, it, it means, means that tasks we... lie to you, and we're doing hundred percent first. <laughs> I didn't lie. I didn't lie. Uh, we are going to take 207 items. That is all of the items in the game. Oh, bad start. But it's oh, there we go. Got over. Uh, and we're going to bring them back to that starting area. So the the rules for the category state that all the items have to be behind that gate. So that is what we're going to do. Uh, but in order to do that, we're not just going to immediately start. Uh, we got them wet, 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 wet. I know. Um, we can't just go and straight move the items, so you guys have to like relax just a little bit uh, when we get started here. We have to do a casual 100% of the game first. Now, Thunder, why do we have to do that? Well, we actually have to do that because there are a couple items that don't show up. Ye okay, that oh, don't wow. show up in the game until we complete every single task that there is, which is the crowns and boxes. Uh, however, if we, sir, really, um, if we don't ever, if we don't ever complete every single task in this game, we never get that. Therefore, we don't get all items. So we need to get that. And the easiest yep. way to do that is by doing the 100% category first, or at least 98% of it. Yeah. So we have to spawn those crowns uh, that you get for completing everything. Spoiler. Um, and then we also have to, uh, sir. Cool. Uh, yeah, so, uh, and then in co-op, there are all those crowns, uh, two different crowns that we spawn. Uh, so we do actually already have four items in the in the, the starter area already. Those are the uh, the freebies. Um, those are going to be uh, one boot that we passed, uh, one can uh, already opened, a tennis ball, and that bolt to the gate that we opened right at the beginning. Uh, so those four items already done. We get those just for beginning the game. If you play, you have already gotten four 207 of the way there as well. Uh, when the game first came out, there were only 206 items, but a year in, there was the co-op update, which allows us to do this as a co-op run, uh, and they added in a second ribbon. That is the 207th item. It is a blue ribbon, so Goose and Toos can both be beautiful while on the loose. So I am Goose, uh, Thunder is Toos. I'm the good-looking one. Uh, Thunder is, you know, also good looking. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
so what you might be wondering about the hundred percent, like what are we doing uh, and why are we doing all of this stuff? Um, so we're doing all of the main tasks uh, for the game. That's part of 100 uh, percent. And we have to do them fast. So we've just finished um, garden. So we're done one out of the four areas already. Uh, you, if you wow, blinked, you missed it. That was it. really fast. Like that—that that was impressive uh, coordination. Why was there. he already up there still? I don't know. I'm confused. We're fine. We're fine. Okay, I'm really. Confused. He was just doing. He was okay. doing willy things. Yeah. Okay. Which that's, who knows what that means? That's never happened before. Uh, <laughs> <Really>? <laughs> Classic <laughs> goose game RNG. Yeah. Uh, Unpredictable. That was really weird. That was that was really weird. Uh, anyway, so um, the the hardest part of the hundred percent is the speed tasks. So the game has uh, like seven to eight main tasks, a final task in each area, and then there are also fifty. I got both shoes by accident. Um, I got I got it. I got the spade. Thank you. Um, I'll get through. There are fifteen hidden tasks. So we did Fine. a couple of those already uh, to get them out of the way. So we stole his keys. Um, and locked him out. So stealing his keys was a main task. Locking him out of his garden was a hidden task. Uh, we also did the cabbage picnic. You saw me push that cabbage. That is a hidden task as well. Uh, we're gonna clear a bunch of hidden tasks out here, um, but some of them we're gonna have to clean up in a post game as well. Uh, but yeah, the hardest stuff is the speed task. So we have seven minutes to complete all of the main tasks in each area. But we are professional geese here, so you may have noticed that we did not reset when we came into High Street. This is High Street, the second area. So we've done both Garden and High Street in the same seven minute period. Uh, I'm luring the boy over here because that is part of a hidden task as well, so we're gonna clear that out. Uh, so we're doing the final task. The final task is to lock the shopkeeper uh, into the garage. Uh, he's not in a good position. Okay, yeah. Uh, but so locking the shopkeeper, final task. Locking the boy is one of the hidden tasks. So we're gonna clear both of those out. Boom, goodbye. Uh, we will see them again though. We, they, that's not permanent. Um, and now, so we're doing the shopping. Thunder is starting on the shopping. Uh, I just dinged the scales. That's another hidden task. Uh, each area has a gather task and that is the longest and most, uh, can you get the poopy paper? Yep. Thank you. Uh, it, it's the, sorry, that's what we call it. It's it's the Lou paper. That's the official name. The The devs are Australian, but the game is set in a, a British village. So it's the Lou paper. Uh, it, it, I, I'll, I'll, we, won't be, we won't be cruder than that or try not to. Um, I don't know what Thunder's doing. Uh, Making a racket. Good, good sound design, uh, please. <laughs> There we go. So as soon as the music changes, we can uh, then reset, and that will actually warp us up higher into the starting area. And, and doesn't that reset the timer, right? Okay, yes. that's what I was so thinking this is, as well. Uh, so we got good RNG here. Uh, this is Roger. Roger has uh, usually two, but occasionally three different starting positions, and we want him on the newspaper, because that's the cycle we want. Um, he can also be on T, and so that would lose us time. We need to hide some of his items here, uh, just because it, it saves us time. Excuse me, sir. Uh, uh, so, um, basically, because we need him distracted and doing other tasks and having the newspaper or that slipper um, delays him being on the cycles that we want him on. Uh, Tina is the, is the other neighbor. These are Roger and Tina, the, uh, the, the tidy and the messy neighbors. Um, I'll let you figure out which one is which. So there again, there are a bunch of tasks uh, that we're having to do. Thunder is setting up um, one of them for for me on the teamwork side. Thunder, uh, th there were some glitches uh, that you saw. Thunder like clipped the hat through. I clipped uh, that glass through to get the the music to trigger. Um, walls are kind of like optional in this game. Uh, you can kind of clip through really easily on stuff. I am now a fancy goose. Let's I will go. Be a fancy goose. That is the best task in the game. I am I, completely I biased. You, yeah. Uh, I, you, wait. <laughs> but you that is like the best ribbons? part of the game. <laughs> I, I I never would have guessed that you like ribbons. <laughs> Shocking. Uh, so we're going to do the gather task now. This is basically an on rails section. Um, no matter what Thunder and I do, like everything will work out on the exact same timing schedule. Uh, so we know that we have like a couple of seconds free in what we're doing. 
We are we 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 are professional geese here, professional uh, mischief makers, causers of chaos. Uh, and so, you know, uh, Thunder will go and show uh, his butt to Roger there. That is a, a way of asserting dominance in the uh, animal hierarchy there. Uh, but for whatever reason, um, NPCs, like if you're looking at an NPC, they'll just stare at you instead of doing what you want them to do. But if you show them your butt, they will uh, ignore you and go back to what they're doing. So, so it, w there, there are actually, oh, oh, no. oh Tina. So sometimes uh, Tina just forgets about her cheers. She'll drop them and just be like, oops, where did they go? I definitely don't know that they're right behind me. Uh, and we actually have to just reopen the gate and restart that process. So it does lose us some time here. Um, and we have, we do have a decent bit of uh, leeway. Uh, we have about 70 seconds uh, between this area and the next area of time loss and uh, without missing the cycle. But 70 seconds is, is not as long as you might think. There we go. Uh, just clip out with the flower. Clipping was... with the flower is kind of hard. Clipping with the sock is really easy. That's incredible. They did, just they did let a me really, just go really through this gate. Thank you, sock. Making sure. It's a yeah, sock-assisted speed run. Yeah, incredible. Sure that, that Roger didn't go after them at all uh, after uh, getting the rose cut and didn't grab him with the sock either. So very good negotiation. It looked like they weren't doing anything for a bit. They were actually just being careful not to get caught. So there's an invisible wall here. We're actually waiting on Tina uh, before we can get through this. She opens something up back in the back garden and we have to wait before we can go through. So, uh, but the sock is really good at clipping. Also, we had to go that way um, because I otherwise, if we go the normal way, the there is a bush that will take the ribbon off of me, but where the ribbon is a hidden task that we need here. And so clipping out is actually the only way we can do. Uh, we can go, words. Uh, it also happens to be faster, so it's uh, it works out really nicely. Now, this is the, the pub lady. The, the pub lady is one part linebacker, one part terminator. Uh, Thunder is being my linebacker here and is doing a phenomenal job of distracting her so that I can actually do the first part of the gather task. That's uh, so clutch, because this is a uh, okay. really hard uh, section. All right. I'm gonna come around again here. So we're doing a bunch of stuff all at once. Uh, darn it, you almost got in there. So this is the, the proximity. If you see those lines, um, that basically is the furthest away that Thunder and I can get from each other. Shit, sorry, sorry. shoot. Um, Where to charge? Uh, it's, it's, it's donation for GDQ. Uh, Oh, nice. Uh, very clutch there, Thunder. Thank you. Great for being cycle. On top of it. Absolutely. Yeah, way, way to make that. That was really nice. Uh, and we take his hat because that's a hidden task, but we're also going to use it in post game. Thun and Thunder is going to do a really hard clip right there. Wow. Beautiful. That was fast. Whoa, yep. you, can clip you can drop it over there? Yep, yes. it's really hard. Wow. It's a very precise angle. Wow, I missed it. Uh, like, a, can you put a <laughs> pint glass in the water for us? Uh, also, shout outs to uh, Leica and Space for being our amazing tracker. Um, oh, this is, okay. So we're now bad. we have to deal with, with Pub Lady. Uh, okay. uh, she's up in me, so. Yep, I'm, I'm gonna take everything. items if I can. Uh, is it just okay. the one left? Or is there others? Yeah, it's just the, it's just the bump. Okay, it's just I the got one it, left. I got it, I got it. Or you got it? Okay. I, I got it. Okay. Old okay. man's going to darts. I'm, I'm dancing. Dance. I'm dancing. Oh my god. Nope, got the wrong item. <laughs> uh, at some point, we get this, please. You have darts? Yep, I have darts. Okay. Good. We're good. Thank you. You I have just take it from you. <laughs> nope. You took the wrong item. Don't need to vote. Yeah, I, I could hear I could hear the boat sound. Uh, are you okay, Thunder? What are yeah. you doing? We didn't set table, did we? No. What are you doing? Oh, I was paying attention to you. I actually okay. lost track of myself. Sorry. Yeah, you're the they one. They do had the look boat very similar. I mean. Okay, but I'm the fancy one. That's true. All right, hit the hit that on the table. Perfect. Okay. Good. All right, you can uh, ignore the table now. So she should. There we go. Okay, she's we're good. good. All right. Woo. Uh, Woo. All right. Now we should still be okay. Can you hide okay. her um, her nappy? Yep. Maybe on the way back. Uh, I need you in range, please. Yep. Cool. Thank you, sir. Uh, okay. So we are great. We are on this this timer in this cycle. The nappy. Okay. No, not gonna take the nappy. I got it. So uh, I'm just basically prepping for the all items part by by taking this and hiding it. 
Um, if, if the bell rings, we lose like four or five minutes here and have to redo the area. So hopefully that doesn't happen. Um, we'll see. We lost it. Oh. That's unfortunate. Yeah. That's a tough area yeah. to do well. Try, trying to pair levels three and four together in seven minutes is is difficult. It's, it's pretty doable, tight. Yeah. But that is, it is unfortunate. We we get it probably 85 percent of the time, I would say. Uh, but we didn't get it here. Um, so you get to see uh, pub again. We do. Uh, you don't get to see that fancy clip. Uh, and Leica, can you remove the pint glass? Because it's not in the water anymore. So that's the other problem is, with, with all of this is that um, resetting will reset all of the items in, in the area. So that is part of the reason that, you know, we were hoping to not have to reset. Um, but it's okay. Uh, we've, we, we know the, the two reset stuff here. Yep. And you have more time than last time, right? Because so we have the full seven to, minutes. Yeah, now. you have the yeah, full seven minutes. So there's no there's no chance of us missing the speed timer uh, the this time around. The difference is going to come later on in the run when they do clean up for hundred um, percent. Yeah. The way they have it routed, they expect certain things in a certain position in back garden, as well as pub. And now that they've reset, back garden is back to normal. Oh, I see. Okay, that makes so, sense. So, uh, yeah, so basically, so that flower that I took and I put in the basket, that won't be there anymore. So we have to go and get that again, um, which means you get to see that rose clip again. True. Uh, in post game. So, um, that's the fun part about no resets is you gotta, you know, you gotta the backup strats and being confident with knowing what to do in all kinds of situations. Yep, it'll be fine just means more time that we get to hang out with with everyone here chat we get to hang out with you uh all right and so then we need to get old man who was just going to sit down i, I oh we're, my God. we're we're getting Dueling. way too close with each other <laughs> <laughs> way too cozy yeah, the candlestick is just way too wide uh it is a large object so again we show butt here uh and that way he will not stare at us and we'll go back and do his own thing too soon Dueling. Really? That is uh, that is my bad then. Normally, as soon as he turns around, you can grab that. We'll we'll wait slightly longer. Mm. Ah, he refocused his feet. That was why. Okay. There we so go. So now now we've done all of the tasks here, right? Um, I glass. think so. Uh, we just need the pint glass. Well, pint glass we do at the end. Yep. I know. Just make sure you don't forget it. Wait, she's still. She's not coming down. What did we miss? Because she already did it. She already opened oh, it up. Oh, God, I'm getting so confused by this. Old man um, is, Oh, and uh, old man's getting his hat back. So Wow, followed you all the way. Yeah, I was trying to grab it right there. So it only, oh, wow. Um, that hat only has one um, point of grab on it. The other hats in the game have two. Um, so I, I whiffed on grabbing it because it's it's actually a really difficult item to grab due to its geometry. He's gonna chase thunder. Yep. Okay. <clears throat> so we'll have to grab that again in post game. Come on. Yeah, I, I thought you were too close to him. That's kind of why I said that. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> so you can't get him off there. Uh, you need to just come around. Right, and now I'm too close. But you're yep. better at this. Am I? Pub okay. was always the hardest section for me when I was learning <laughs> this game. There's a lot okay. that can go wrong. Uh, so there's also a really weird thing here um, with with this gentleman um, where we'll go under their pier to like lose him. And then oh, he just, he, hey, yeah, he, he just, just did it. He just, he just, yeah, there we go. Okay. Uh, we don't really understand why that happens. Um, and. Wait, what is he doing? The he signs didn't missing. see the sign going, so he it's fine. <laughs> so yeah, we we have actually, as a speedrunning community, have no idea why sometimes um, he doesn't stop and sometimes he does stop. So um, it's just one more fun thing. So Thunder has the pint glass because that is uh, an item, and we don't do the clip in uh, in this two reset thing. But now we have to deal with Pub Lady, um, and this is a problem. 
We have too many NPCs. <laughs> too many there soups in the so kitchen. Too many, here. yeah. Okay. Uh, uh, I need you to I, come out here, dude. We're gonna be too far away. Oh no. Uh, oh, but I'm so scared about this pine glass. glass. Yep, that's no. why I didn't want to go out. It, it's okay. okay. I, it's okay though. You didn't break it, so. Right. Yeah, we can just re-grab it here. Okay. And then we're, we're I, moving. Just don't break it. Don't break it. It's good. We're good. We got it. We're good. Oh my gosh. No, he's, he's gonna keep. He's no, no, gonna no. keep chasing that item Ooh. because it's an item that he cares about in pub. He will keep chasing. Wow. Um, no, unless it's yeah. under the bridge. There we go. Okay. And, we're uh, good. Whew. That was stressful. No. Oh no! Don't grab that. Do not. <laughs> So, um, basically, if... Okay, that was a, that was a thing <laughs> that just happened. You just chucked that at him, um, Max. <laughs> so, uh, Never if, change, Goose if, if a pint glass breaks, that means we can't return that item home. Uh, and therefore, technically, you would think that that would make the run invalid. Uh, but we're, as a community, kind of... I'm, am I stuck? All right, there we you go. You got it. Um... We're, we're, we're kind and generous people, so we just give a three-minute time penalty uh, if you break a pint glass in this category. Um, but if you break all three of them, one will respawn, but if you only break one, it will not respawn. So, uh, Also, again, as we've mentioned before, you know, walls and, uh, all, and gates, all these things are optional in this game, so, you know, we, we just clip through. Uh, bell return, schmell return. Uh, and so, okay, we are going to have the baby goose uh, is going to be returned home. That will be one of our first items that we've brought back. Let's go. What a friend. Yeah. Uh, no, take it further. That is not even in. <laughs> you literally yeah, didn't is. even take it. No, in. It's, no, it's not. It has to be behind the gate. You put it on the gate. <laughs> we'll That's not in. in. We're we'll fix it in post. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, that's that's not in. I thought you were gonna take it like halfway all the way back. You you didn't need to be nearly that precise with it. Um, <laughs> like put it where the boot was. It would have been would have been right. great. Wow, anyway, credits rolling. Important. What are we doing for so, the rest of the three hours here? Uh yeah no yeah. Uh so we do have cleanup. We haven't actually finished the hundred percent to spawn okay. those items. Oh, we are just so, getting started. Yeah. <laughs> so so we did have to do that uh, as part of. Oh hello sir, you're still here. Um, you can't get, you can't get there. You can't go through the thing. That's, <laughs> he's gonna he's try out of the way his now. best, okay? He's the out of the way, so that's, that's nice. Um, kisses. We have some kisses going on right here. <laughs> Friendly geese. Oh, I need to get his hat back. Might as well do that now. Go negotiate with him. Oh, uh. Oh, oh dear God. Vinny's back. He's coming back. It's fine. Okay. I, I almost first framed that. If you first frame it, he stands right back up and it doesn't count as him falling over. Box girl, box girl, no. An unstoppable okay. force. Yeah. So NPCs have a uh, priority amongst themselves and she has the highest priority. So she will just push other NPCs oh, wow. out of the way. I see. Ah, oh, crap. Uh, nope. I have the magic flower that he wants. He's going to fall. Okay. Uh, so I'm just going to get this out of the way. All right. Cool. We're fine. Everything is fine. We're back on track. Uh, the box is a magic item in this game as well. So we're going to put oh, multiple things. Yeah, he's coming. Coming for uh, it. Yeah. Okay. Um, do you want to so, keep him there? Maybe I can get past. This is dangerous a, yes, right now. Is. Um, oh, good box. Do not, do not recommend uh, that you try this at home. No, y'all are with, expert geese. With, Precision. With, uh, with Vinny there, that was that, that was that scary. Was that was scary. scary. Um, that was. So here's here's the the extra item. Here is our blue ribbon. I am I am going to help right now. And boom, there we go. I have helped. So this is clean up in post game for the 100% part of the run. Um, the most tedious part of this cleanup is doing the five flowers. So we have to take one flower from each of the four areas plus the final area, the model village, and bring it to that basket. So we've already brought three flowers there. Um, and if we hadn't had to reset in the middle, we would actually have four of them. Uh, but the rose got teleported back. So we're gonna have to grab that again, which changes up the, our routing uh, a little bit. 
but it will be fine. Uh, actually, as a matter of fact, we're we're gonna have to remember that uh, thunder, right? Because we're not actually going to go that way. We're still gonna take the rose and put it through the yeah, house. Yeah, we still. We're need just to we're just gonna have to back. remember. Uh, so tripping the boy, it wasn't just for funsies. That is a hidden task. Um, and uh, and now we're gonna play soccer as well. Um, I if if you do this. With the soccer ball, I don't recommend going this way. It is significantly harder than going out the right side of High Street, but because of all the other items that we have, um, it, it, this is really the only way we can go for this run without losing a bunch of time. Yeah, uh, like the little bits and bobs on the sidewalks are hard. The camera doesn't cooperate. There's all kinds of things that make it hard to push the soccer ball harder than are, normal. There are also lots of invisible hills. Uh, and you don't always realize that you are on a slope uh, just due to the color palette and the flatness of the game. So uh, if you misplace your soccer ball, boop, it just rolls down a hill that you didn't know was even a hill. Uh, this is the most exciting part of the run, guaranteed. The two geese pushing five items at one time. <laughs> it's definitely efficient, that's for sure. Yep. It is, it is efficient. Um, so the box actually does get slower as you have more items in it. So you can't just put like five items in it and move them all at one time. Uh, two is really the limit of things that you can put in there. Uh, it, it is faster to move it if there are zero or one, but as soon as you put a third item into it, it becomes nearly immovable. Uh, there we go. So, and this is, uh, oh, sideways. Uh, come out. There you go. Okay. Uh, oh, I was going to try to help uh, push that back. Like, hold, on, hold on, stop moving. Let me get your stuff I'm not back moving. <laughs> okay. Uh, there we go. Yep. So we're almost done with the quote unquote 100%, although because of little yeet there. Uh, because of everything, uh, we won't actually get the trigger on the five flowers until a lot later in this run. Um, Tina. Tina, please. Tina. Tina, Tina. please. There Tina. <laughs> she, she, she saw the hedge. So we need her to, to clip that um, again so that we can There's get that flower. Uh, more hidden tasks. So there we go. We've caught an item. We've had an item thrown over. Uh, we can catch another item. So, and then, and the reason we have all of this stuff is, again, another hidden task is have the bust made up with items from outside of High Street. Um, and then we have the soccer ball because that, again, is hidden item, hidden task. So, uh, there's all of these different, um, hidden tasks that we're doing for our cleanup because all of the main stuff was done before credits rolled. Uh, and so we're, as soon as the soccer ball goes in, um, camera, please, uh, that is when we are going to start the all items portion of the run. So this is the very end of what we're going to do uh, for the thing. And then and then and then uh, the real treat begins. So there we go. We are now going Yay! to begin. And the first thing we are going to do here now that our 100 percent is done uh, is to put all of these items into the house. Is it done? I didn't see the item. Well, yeah, we didn't do the flowers yet. Because the flowers. Right. Okay. So that won't actually trigger until uh, pretty late. Oh. Yeah. So we just need to make sure that we get those two flowers back and that we put them in the basket um, at the end. So. so I have never run this category, so I'm seeing all of this completely blind. I, I helped her out with Hundo and, and uh, Co-op Hundo, but like what they're doing now, I have no idea. Can't, so can't wait to see what's basically, we do not want to go into the house. Uh, if we go too far into the house, we will get pushed through to the other side, and it's going to lose us a lot of time having to run around back. So uh, everything we're going to do here in moving stuff. Can you hit the, the bell? Can you hit the bell? Yep. Oh, crap. Uh, so using the bell is just a great way to get to Enough. please. Thank you. Uh, to stall her because she will stop what she's doing and fix the bell. Yeah, I was gonna say, yeah, thanks. Grab that. Um, crap. I need your help with this. Yeah, this, this is one of the hardest items, uh, is, is the... 
She can be really difficult. Can you hit the bell again? Very can you just hit the, yep. hit the bell? That's that's what we need. We need her off here with the bell. Um, it's this yeah. this item is probably the hardest. So we cleared the and the that the, the sign is also um, challenging. Thank you. There oh, you go. Nice. That, was, that was very I don't know good. Why. That just works. Yep. Um, so yeah, and so we're just we're gonna kind of just push it and be safe. Uh, with with our movement to make sure that we don't go in ourselves too far. Okay, uh, and so now we're gonna go over to back to Roger's side, uh, and we're gonna get a bunch all of his stuff off. Uh, do you want to try to get teapot, teacup or teapot? Yep. So I'm gonna do this, and I, I'm just gonna distract him. You do that, and you're fine. Okay. Yep. Yep. You lost. Perfect. That's it. So, draggable items are slower. Um, nice. Yep. And as soon as they're off on the other side, uh, he's, he's, we're good. Yep. yep. So, and then we can go back and get more. We need to do get his slippers and everything. Um, but I think we can flip this through, maybe? Not really sure. Like, this isn't this isn't really items that we like do a lot of playing with. Uh, Worth I'm a sure shot, I way. guess. <laughs> yeah. You can also, you know, clip over if you uh, can like wall climb. Like you see Tass there doing a wall climb to get the ball on the there other side. And I just I just put it on the other side. Uh, all right, and we'll take this newspaper. Uh, don't we want him to read the newspaper to get his slippers? Oh, yeah, we do need to get the slipper. That is a good point. <laughs> right, no, so he doesn't should... have to read it to get it. He just has to think about it. Uh, do you want to come back? Yeah. Uh, that way we'll, we'll give him time to, to do stuff so we can... And so we're trying to do all of these draggable items first because, again, they're the hardest ones to get uh, into the, the house. Do you imagine having to get the either the soccer ball or the uh, cabbages through that house? Yeah, that's why we did the soccer ball first. That is exactly why. Okay, it's good, good enough. And you uh, talked right, you so talked let's... about it being dangerous because if you get pushed through the house, you have to run all the way back. Is that it's if, still not here? Is that if both yeah. of you are in the house, or just if one either of you one. goes too far? Yep. Oh, okay. Either one, because of the fact that we're tethered to each other, um, it's it's either one. Okay, that's scary. Okay. <laughs> yes, it is. All right, here, come. Let's just move items here, because because uh, he's gonna be stuck for a while. Um, before. Wait, did we leave him with a tea? Oh, uh, he doesn't we actually left need him a teacup. Tea nope. We, well, we it doesn't matter with... either. He doesn't uh, need either of the items. He just has to think about them. So, but we'll we'll leave the newspaper with him, and we'll just move other stuff um, until he's back. So, yeah, le accidentally leaving an item behind uh, are all sorts of you know fears. Uh, oh yeah, Jeremy. So the this the there's only one item in the entire game, or one character in the entire game that has a name, uh, and it is this fish right here. This is uh, Jeremy. Hi, Jeremy. Thank you. Gotta yep. be an inside joke. That's a friend. Uh, and the and it's not listed in the game. the The name Jeremy is in a catalog that came with the lovely uh, physical edition. We should we need to get the box. Stuff. Uh, um, and soap. You want to get soap? Yep. Uh, so we need uh, yeah we need the box. Box is going to be maybe we should probably get uh, have the box be the last thing and we drive we we grab it through because uh, I don't think we're going to get it in otherwise but we'll want to no. move it over uh, okay I, I got I got you here okay uh, grab newspaper you want to grab newspaper from him oh crap yeah or I can try to distract or from behind him maybe teacup. You take yeah, key grab, cup, grab, if you take the key cup, he'll drop the newspaper and chase you, and then I can grab this from him. Cool. All right, and so now he should... Uh, maybe? Okay. Okay. Yep. Just going to move it over, because anything that goes over is then outside of his range. Uh, so yeah, so this is the only stuff we have left on this side is the teacup and the second slipper. 
Oh, I think there's some a really important thing, actually, that we haven't mentioned at all. Thunder and I have never done this before. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is the first time we're we, actually doing all items we, together. I feel like that was an important Go. piece um, that we, we've neglected to mention. Thunder and I have never run co-op all items before together. Um, I've done it once with someone else, and that is the only time this category has ever been run before. So that is why we're kind of talking through a bunch of stuff without really having good answers. Because uh, we haven't done this before. But that's what makes it exciting. It's a debut. Yes. It's, it's, yes. This is... It's, it's live co-op action right here. Yeah, uh -oh. we've, we've done... Um, <laughs> we've done 100% many, many, many times. But Don't we've never... The ball. Yeah. Uh, but we've never done all items part. Of this Do we want to grab the frog and then... Yeah, we uh, want to grab the frog and the shears. And the goose, and the goose, or duck, what, the imposter. Yep. Whatever it is. <laughs> You're fine. You, uh, it's, oh, yeah, the ball's good. Yep. <clears throat> uh, I was stuck on geometry. It's fine. Gar so guaranteed second place, uh, probable world record, yes. Uh, if we can not keep knocking stuff back out. Which is definitely oh. a, a problem here. Okay, get it in. No, I, like... I, I have a good idea what the trigger is um, on getting this stuff in. Uh, okay. Oh! See, it's, it's not, it's not we'll the getting. Clean. It's not the getting in. It's actually okay, the so getting back here's out. Here's what we'll do. Like, leave that be. When we're doing the box or whatever heavy go. item is causing a problem, we'll both do now. it. So that's shears or your your. Yeah, shears are fine. Okay. Or not. I guess she's going to chill uh, over here. Okay. So you get the box. I'll get the, the duck. Yes. There we go. We do have a question from chat. What is the current world record in this category? Two hours, 49 minutes, and 13 seconds. Bell, 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 yep. bell, 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 please. <laughs> that just needs to be the default. Sorry. It's, it's how we can, it's how we distract her. Yeah, that uh, makes sense. Yeah, she has two very high priority items, the bell and the fence. They they absolutely dominate her her AI. So depending on where she is and where you need her to be, either the bell or the fence is going to be their go-to solution for dealing with Tina. Yep. Uh and also so an interesting thing um is if you grab an item from like the first frame of range, it will pop up into the air. Uh, and so we use that a lot to get through this fence uh, with items that otherwise don't seem like they can get through. Yep. And I did that right there with the duck. A yep. little yeet to get through. Yep. A little, little That's pop good. and we'll shuffle put, uh, or, or something. Yeah, we'll grab, those, items and... those, we'll grab those yeah. and carry them through ourselves uh, to make sure that they actually go through. We hope you can't make the game crash that way. Uh, as far as we know, you can't anymore. Uh, people did try similar stuff to this back on the 1.0 version uh, of the game, and they did crash it, uh, but it, it it was fixed in subsequent, and you just leave it, leave it, leave it, leave it. Leave it. Um, and it's never crashed on a speedrunner doing good. this category, doing an all items category. And this I, is fine. We do have another question from some viewers that are coming in. Why are you stashing everything in the house? What's going on here? Uh, it's faster. Yep. So I've seen a little bit of like the tech for this, and you'll see what happens when they're done. And, and, and I don't want to spoil it, but it's spectacular. <laughs> yeah, just don't don't worry. We'll find out, and it's going to be amazing. I'm very excited to see it. Uh, we have we have a bra, a newspaper, and two socks left. So grab a sock, or yeah, that works fine. Uh, yep. So we have one more trip here. Is that a uh, picture on the ladder grabbable? Yeah. Oh yes. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I thought we had gotten that earlier. So thank Did you. Did you Ritz. Oh, whatever. Uh, good good guy newspaper there. Okay. Good job. Poor Roger. 
getting a headache now. He is he is getting a heck of a headache from his messy neighbor. Well, they could clip out with these socks, but then they wouldn't be able to take advantage of what they've been spending all this time doing. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. So. All right. Now for the very delicate uh, final touches. There's so much in the way. <laughs> yes. Uh, okay. Can we get the socks in? Wedge them in like the corner. Uh, I can't grab we the sock. Need the, we need the ribbon and the ribbon too. Can you yep. somehow get that in there? I like don't want to move because I have so much stuff. Yep, that yep, I'm yep. Holding back, but Hold the, the ribbon door. is the ribbon is not in. Okay. Uh, so here we go, guys. All you right. ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? I'm so ready. <laughs> there we go. We're going. Oh my god. Oh. You having issues there? Uh, yeah, I was. I have a lot of stuff that I, I was all the pushing marks. back. <laughs> all the question marks. All right. Now. <laughs> Uh, Count doors. Like, oh my oh god! god. Many times there the door is. Shows. <laughs> All right. Hopefully that's oh, everything. Man. All right. Grab a grab the the cricket bat. That or is the amazing. Goose sign. All right. So we have a uh, we have the big goose sign and we have the white and blue mug. Uh, and again, shout outs to our trackers, uh, Leica and Hit Marty. Um, little lag there. All right. So what we're doing now is we're bringing everything into the canal. Uh, there we go. Uh, all, nope. all of the oh, end, of, end of stuff, yeah. Boot, uh, pacifier, Boot. and glass. So we're, we're going to read off our yeah, words, state out all of the items that we're taking into the water. And our trackers are, are marking everything off for us um, on a spreadsheet that we have that's uh, not on screen. But, Just ask uh, you, Cricket Back. Yeah, uh, Jeremy and Cricket Bat. Um, and so basically what it is, is you'll notice all those items before are no longer here. There is a current, and so the current is going to carry all of these items closer to the starting area, which is our goal. Uh, duck statue? Oh, you, God, Ooh, I thought what it was that? you. Hey, you uh, can probably put you. stuff in that. Uh, so you are, he already actually has an extra item. There's the, the pipe is stuck in yeah. there. The question so is, nice. can you put like a third item? Probably, you probably could. Probably could. Uh, so we have we have duck statue. There was a, a long debate uh -oh. uh, of whether it was a duck or a goose statue, but we checked the game code and it is a duck. Um, and the drawer and a pipe. There we go. Uh, oh no! Oh, <laughs> no. Why? Okay, that's fine. <laughs> it's fine. As long as you can reach uh, it. Uh, traffic yep. cone. You're gonna take the traffic cone in. Okay. Honk, please. I can at least uh, move it like a little bit. And then we okay. can push it so in. traffic cone not quite in, but we'll we'll get it in there. Um, the ox, get the you want to get the the parcel? Yeah. Yep. So there are a couple of items that are specific uh, already here, uh, like that parcel, and then there's a piece of mail uh, at the other house's doorway, which you got I glasses think is too. Yep. There's you got a Rogers of glasses. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I have a pair of glasses. You have Rogers Tim glasses. I Rogers saw a second glasses. item in there. Not yep. Timmy's. I, w I wasn't sure which one. We didn't grab Timmy. Uh, it might be Timmy. Well, yes, we, there's, yes, there's, we there's do two have pairs of glasses because one's yeah. from outside and yeah, one is one's, Rogers. Yep, okay. we have Timmy's in there. So, it's but one whatever it is, that was one pair. Uh, uh, do you want to grab the other? And then frog statue. Oh, okay. We'll do that because uh, we do need to get the other piece of mail. I see Timmy's glasses there next to the slipper. So you got Rogers out there. Okay. Uh, you know, just, uh, just just a little bit of uh, wildlife pollution here. I'm Fire. sorry, we're we're decluttering the neighborhood. Yeah, you're uh, just have, you you're to, cleaning everything up. Oh, yeah. Grab, the, grab the, the other half or or not. I thought you, you could just grab the other, make it easy. This but is Goose Community Service, if you ask me. Yeah, we're uh, the litter patrol. Yeah. So all the uh, like what for, what else were the NPCs doing with these stuff? They weren't doing anything. I felt clearly everything was just sitting around taking up space. So we we do intentionally like fall into the water when we have a draggable object, but the goal with the non-draggable well that was that was not efficient. Uh the goal with the non-draggable items not is this. to drop them in. Wait, why not? Yep. Wait, why do we still why have not? flowers and I'd rather not go sorting for that? <laughs> Oh, no, we have to, because we're going to go to uh, pub next. So we're not going to take this with us all the way to pub. Don't we go to... Also, there's uh, two there are two flowers here, not one. So Don't we go to the bridge to get the um, 
to get we tackle do. gear. Yeah. Oh, Before so you punch? want to just take the flowers over to the bridge? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Let's yeah. let's do that then. Why we'll do that. Running? So let's we'll get the two. Uh, I'll see about the other flower. Uh, so as you can pot. see, we we don't we don't really have a strategy here. We're well, we have a yeah. little strategy. We like we're we, yeah. It's but, best if you two move together so that you don't get stuck on the edges. Yeah, like we're trying to hit draggable items together. We're trying to get non-draggables together uh, because socks. you do move. Oh, we both fell in. Yep. Uh, you do move slower. With badminton's hot. Uh, you do move slower if you are dragging an object versus carrying it. So. Uh, I think there was an item. Yep. Uh, There's one under that house on the left. The oh, pink yeah, object I see over it. there. It's a soap. Of course, it's yeah. the soap. Oh, uh, yeah, the soap skids when it lands. It it does skid. All right, uh, I'm just getting soccer ball partway on. We'll right. we'll keep moving it as we go. Roger's hat. This, this camera is lovely, by the way. I don't know if you guys uh, can see this, but um, it's a thing. Extremely that helpful. Yes. Mm -hmm. It's very helpful camera. I love up, the bro? perfect little pink bubbles. Every time you play with a soap. Yeah, we're just making it one big giant bath. We're cle we're decluttering and cleaning items at Super the same laundry. time. Yeah, exactly. We're we're doing all of the laundry. We do actually have and a meme category of clothes percent where you have to take all of the clothing in the game um, and bring it into a, any piece of water. So that's that's fun. And the soap. I think. I think you need the soap. If not, we should have. And that was probably my mistake. I can't see what I'm doing right now. Who needs cameras? <laughs> Who needs cameras? <laughs> Who needs to be able to see what you're doing in the video game? Okay. Yeah, it's tough moving the soccer ball over all of those various uh, little lumps and steps and stuff. Because the ball does get stuck on them. And so you have to have some amount of force to get them. There we go. Oh, there we go. Just down the stairs. Uh, ball we'll and the ribbon. Is, are those the only things we have left? Uh, I think no, there's we have, paper. We have two and... more. All right, so we have two more items after this. Perfect. Um, and then I think that should be everything. I'll wanna, uh, we, we can look uh, real quick at the tracker. I don't know if you have the tracker up or not, but I do. Uh, I have it up on my phone. Cool. Uh, so we got the other slipper. The the rose not in. Ribbon went in. Uh, soap went in. You went in. <laughs> uh, okay. I think I think that's everything. So let okay. Let's move our flowers and cool. One of the nice features about the co-op update is that it made oh, it light. so that the camera zoom allows you to see question marks even if you're zoomed out. Uh, which is a really good feature. Otherwise, uh, sorry, Leica. Yeah. We we need to do a better job of calling items out for Leica. Yeah. Um, all right, goose, so we're gonna, this, too this speedy, too fast. This should trigger. Yay! Yay flowers. flowers now complete. Uh, uh, sorry, and that split poorly. All right, so now uh, we're gonna drop everything into the canal, which will put all of these in water. So all five flowers are going in the canal or in the well. Uh, which will put them out into the water. Uh, and the coin, are you not going to put the coin in? Oh. Make a wish. Everything. Oh puts. my god. Oh, no. This is the worst item. There you yeah. go. Make cool. a wish. Okay. So, uh, and the coin is now in. Uh, and so now we're going to get these items, which is the fishing lure and the tackle box. Uh, don't fall in from the yeah, tackle no, box. Yeah, push it in. Thank you, chat, for helping out with uh, keeping track of our items as well. There we go. Much appreciated. Tack tackle box. Yeah, uh, Leica, <laughs> if you're not sure, definitely ask chat, and I'm sure someone will know. Absolutely. They're um, helping out. All right. I'm just going to move this out here. All right. So we're going to get the two tomatoes. There's okay. there's like 11 tomatoes all pulled. Um, all right. Let's, let's get him out here, I guess, instead. He'll fall. Okay. Uh, but the, we're only coming out the front for these two tomatoes. The other nine tomatoes are going to go out the back. We're going to have to hit his shoes again. That's two uh, tomatoes. Yeah, two tomatoes. Two tomato. Well, how many more? Thir uh, 11? Nine I more? I think nine, nine more. Hold on, I got it. Okay. 
ball, please. Thank you, sir. <laughs> uh, I'm probably gonna go in the water. Okay. So I don't. I don't really know if it's even possible to get this in. It might with, be. With, well, all right, I went. I mean, I went in. If you grab one of the items <laughs> floating uh, nearby, you can, okay. okay. Well, you're both in. <laughs> yeah. So we're just we're just gonna go around again. That's that's normal. Uh, so here's oh, a, a lot of the gem. items. <laughs> here's here's a lot of the items. Uh, here. Oh, we need one of these flowers. We need. Nope, not that one. This this one. We're gonna need this flower actually. So we actually want this back here. So that's actually good. Not yet though. So. All right, so now, we're, so now it's time to clear out everything in the pub. Fantastic. So wow. we we did originally try to bring all of the items out the front, but dealing with Roger uh, is is just a huge pain. Okay, Tess, slight yes, concern Vinny. just came up to my head. So cautious about doing pint glass clips. Uh, do you not want to do them? I'd rather not, cause uh, I can't see what the water ha what the water is like below. That's fine. Uh, we'll just take them out. That's no big deal. It's good. It's it's faster than losing three minutes. Per. Oh, it's only three yes. minutes penalty. Um. So some That's of the six items minutes, in, right? Some some of the items in the pub uh, that are challenging are the second box. So the first box we already put in because we took it to pub, um, but there is a second box that the bo that box reel does, uh, and you can't normally grab it. She just holds it her the whole time. Uh, so we have some plate. strats. Yeah, us. Uh, yeah, candlestick and plate. That's definitely. Uh, do you want to grab this stuff? Yeah. Uh, the, grab the other one, the mop and the mop bucket, because they're both draggable. I'm guessing you're going to be doing a lot of clipping of things out the fence into the canal. At least non-breakable things. Uh, we'll clip the rings. The, yeah, the toss rings, since they're not destructible, those are fine. But most other no things we're not going to clip. It's actually um, so the the barriers between like areas themselves are harder to whoops clip through than. Yep, I know. That's why we took the plate first. Plates are really good for elevator clipping and boosting yourself up over walls. And sharing is caring. I mean, but ideally we don't fall in though, because this is this is still slow. Just uh, neck okay. yourself once you're up. Yeah, there you go. Um, but we do have that plate, and we did take it first uh, on purpose so that we would have it to get out if we needed to. And I'm just going to move this second plate since you're kind of behind. Since this is the only other item back here, I'm just going to kind of like... Oh, yeah, you got a tomato. That makes sense. Uh, so the only item back here. We have nine tomatoes. Mm -hmm. Eight tomatoes. I, I forgot. You can't uh, forget what's, the tomatoes. What's, what's so, so never items. forget tomatoes. We do have a question. So it's not one of every single item, but it's one individual item per like cat like you need one tomato you don't have to bring the entire no, bucket no. of tomatoes oh, over no, no, no. we need it's 11 everything. tomatoes oh you do have to get all the tomatoes yes all every single okay. one okay i yep that's hilarious yep. good question got, glad we got that clarification yep so there, there there's a lot of there's gonna be a lot of carrots as well uh and there's gonna be in high street there's gonna be a lot of vegetables not all the same, uh, but there will be a lot of vegetables, 15 of them. A high quantity vegetable I'm stuck. Uh, diet is what calls for all items. Uh, the guy who made tutorials of Flash games? Yep, that is me. I, I helped you beat games that you couldn't figure out yourself. God, there's so many tomatoes. I always hey, forget. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Oh, good call, let's, good let's, let's do this. Uh, honk behind her. Uh, cause we need to scare her, ideally. Uh, can, can we get her, like, straight her thing? behind her? There we go, there we go. Uh, can you grab it? Can you grab it? Yep. Grab it, and just hide it. Nice. Okay, just leave it there, and we'll grab tomatoes. Cool. Box grill defeated. Yep, so that's, that's well probably done. the hardest item to get. Uh, cause she doesn't like to let go of it, and there's no way to get it without taking it from her hands. That's You're me. Just a little stuck. That's me. 
More you tomatoes. know, I need my ribbon back, please. You could just put the little like symbols above your heads, but they're even those are like only slightly different from one another. And wait, there's they symbols? Yeah, there's, yeah, there's indicators symbols. of player one and player two. One is a circle and the other is a square. Oh, I that's funny. Didn't know that existed. Tash, your name's in the and credits, come on. And, and they're and they're both white. That's the problem, is they look so like from far away, mm. if you're just sort of like looking through your periphery, they're not enough to help you. But are, yeah, so the colors of the two geese are very similar. They are. So while, while we're uh, taking these tomatoes back and forth, just want to say really quick that Summer Games Done Quick has been announced and you can find all the information about the dates, submissions, uh, when the stream is going to be happening at gamesdonequick.com on the main page. All of the information is there. And if you have any ideas for your own Hotfix show or one-off events, feel free to go to gamesdonequick.com slash hotfix to submit your ideas. I will be submitting. Uh, we've gotten all of the tomatoes, so that should be yep. 11 tomatoes from pub. So all the tomatoes are done. All the pub tomatoes are done. All the pub tomatoes are done, not all of the tomatoes. Uh, oh, there are more. take care of the deck? Yes, stuff on let's, the deck. let's clear out the deck. And we need to get her towel, so... Oh my gotta, God. Uh, yeah, make yep. sure that box is... Yep. Right, right there. There we go. Uh, got that. Wow. Yep. That was convenient. Ooh, All right. Going for a pint glass. Yep. So the pint glasses <laughs> are are the scary items, as we've said. Um, one of them is already to our left from here. It's in the model village. Under the bridge. Um, so yep. yeah, carry this straight into the water and use the plate to get out. Because uh, yep. that's how I broke chances. one. Is I dropped, I dropped it onto another item. Um, wait, why did I go in? I don't know why I just went in. You Excitement. wanted to make me Plate race. not feel alone. Okay. So there should be one more, uh, and plus the one to our left. So there are three total. Yes. Should be top, top right, left, top side. Uh, and yes, this game is called Untitled Goose Game. That is its title. Technically not confusing not at all. A well, technically, it's not a title because they never came up with a title. Therefore, it's untitled. But uh, it's also a goose game. Do we want to just clip this stuff through or like yes. drop it in the hole? We should probably yeah. just drop this stuff in the hole. Deal with it then. Okay. There's uh, all sorts correct. of ways to get items off the top of the deck there. You can clip it over the, the, the blue flower hedges that are hanging off of the, the white railing. You can poke your head through. This is this is an item, by the way, if you the didn't cork. know. There is a cork that has a uh, barrel of substance. Don't know what the substance is, but probably delicious. And it's infinite, too. Butterscotch ripple. Uh, I think there's a candlestick still, so I, I need to grab that. Um, yep. and, then, and then we can get the pint glass. The la oh, no, wait, where's nope, the candlestick? You got the, it was the Did very first him? one you took. That was oh. the very, very first thing you took. Oh, yeah, we got it with the plate. I forgot. Uh, so that's it. So we got defense. everything from off of here. And the bucket. I'm just taking it. Oh, the bucket. Uh, do you want to drop the bucket? You have uh, to go back. Yeah. You have to go back and under and drop the... Or not. Never mind. Hold but on. once she leaves, she'll leave. Yeah. Uh, or, or she won't. Or she won't. All right, well, uh, do you want to come back for it? You can come back for it. You yeah, got other stuff in pub to grab. Yeah. All right, we just have to remember... Uh, and so we'll do the bucket and the box at the same time, since they're both draggable. Oh, the empty tomato box? Oh, no, toy no, 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 no. Toy boat is in box. Model Village. Yes, the, the toy boat is in the Model Village. Uh, right, I'm and not dropping this. Coming in. Yeah. Uh, all right. Coming back. Yeah. The empty tomato box is not movable. It is nailed down with code. <laughs> Uh, the tomato box can be pushed very... Well, there, there is the top the, of the tomato the, box yeah, can be the, pushed, uh, but only before it gets put into the trash. Uh, so we actually don't count that as an item for this category because it's uh, so squirrely. Uh, you missed... Did you just take that out of my mouth? Sure did. Sorry. You took it out of my mouth. <laughs> it was very rude, and now I'm stuck. Uh, oh, she's coming. All right, I'm hold on. I'm, uh, I'm moving yep, stuff. Yep, She's yep, coming. Yep, yep, yep. I okay. see ya. We're good. Uh, although this is now. Yeah, out. you should probably hide that. Okay. 
Teamwork. Oh, yeah. My tomato boxes bring all the staples to the ground. <laughs> so, ha so we're doing co-op, and then the SMA is about in three hours, correct? Yes. Um, so it's it's definitely would you say it's a little more you know just a little bit more significant than solo which i think your time is four hours 13. uh yeah or four sixteen because i did break a plank glass four sixteen right is. uh so yeah it um doing it in co-op saves about an hour and a half off of this run it is the most significant time save for co-op that there is across all categories not a surprise since uh you know i feel like it's the this, longest category this back and forth you're doing between the pub uh is very slow compared to just doing the pint glass clip with normal items that aren't the pint glass i don't you, i don't think you can uh okay so we we still got bucket yeah yep do you want to do the box Grab, grab the box. Yep. I'll, I'll take it. this. You're annoying. Uh, yeah. And so we need we, we need dartboard also. Um, so that's that's what we can still do. Uh, yep. Dartboard and bucket. Yep. Oh. Stool and box coming in. Yep. So yeah, this... they have to make sure that they pair up with either draggables or carryables so that they both go the same speed when they're traveling. So in this category is not just throwing crap into the river. No, no. Uh, we're this is only part one. There is but wait, there's more. We're gonna take all of the stuff back home after putting it into the river. And that's so, what our that's what our counter's for. Once it actually gets back to the starting area, that's when we're gonna take it off on the counter, right? Yep. Yes. Yeah. Uh yeah, so we are at eight. That is that is accurate. Uh wonderful counter. Uh, where are we at here? Oh, he's okay. We're, he's we're, we got darts. Crisis. We got we got darts. Uh, so you can ring uh, while he darts. Well, no. So there's there's a strat here. Ooh. Uh, wait. I'm sorry. I forgot. It's been a oh. while since I've done this solo. Uh, so getting the dartboard is hard. Um, an old man behaves oddly. But if you give him that, oh, nice. can you can you take the dart? Take, yep. Just take the dart. Um, yeah, because if you don't take the dart, he'll put the dart away. <laughs> and right, and he'll he and he also it. he's going to chase. Um, for whatever reason, he he can track the dart anywhere uh, and the dartboard anywhere. So I do believe he is going to follow all the way out here and get stuck at the fence for a couple of seconds and then turn around and go back home. Uh, so there's one dart in there, and then there's a dartboard with, I believe, two more darts, stu yeah, two two darts, darts stuck yep. to it. Um, Efficiency. So, yeah, you can pull those darts off the dartboard, but we're going to try not to do that, because obviously pulling three items at once is better than pulling one item at yep. once. Sort of like when you guys got kicked out of the, the house earlier, if you had somehow managed to catch the vase, you would have one object yes. to carry instead of two. Which that that would be some ridiculous uh, parkour or matrix stuff. Let me, let me yeah, deal with oh, this you're, before you're I forget. Yeah. You're gonna I get will that. Probably yeah. forget later. So All okay, right. deal with I that. I think that should be just fine as it is. Uh, can you just keep distracting old man and then why like, is yes. the barrel Wait. corked again? Is it? I mean, we is we it? took the cork. I wonder what happened. Maybe she found another one. We'll just take it again if she did. You did that okay. the uh, red, uh, two red ribbons are out. Oh, two he's red coming. Rings. Rings. <laughs> rings, Tass. Rings? Yep. Yeah. I know the you want uh, ribbons. <laughs> the plate can also be clipped out for sure. <laughs> That's kind of a common backup strat in any percent. Please. There we go. Plate. Yeah. So it is hard to clip stuff through this, which is why we only yep. clip certain items. Um, there's there's some stuff that work well. They usually have like large hitboxes. Question: Can um, you guys reach the harmonica? Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm not very good at any percent, which is like where this comes in. Are you good at pine glass clip? Nope. Okay. okay. Uh oh oh he's coming. 
Okay. Luckily, oh, he's, he's very chill wow. when we take Wait, these. Wait, what was that? He, normally, he's not chill like that. No, he only plays with the green rings. He doesn't like the red ones. I don't think that's true at all. <laughs> all right, hey. all of the rings are out. Uh, and so the only wait is the only thing left here the harmonica. I think yes. so. I think so. And the bucket. Yeah. And then we are done uh, with pub. All right. Nice. Plus, yep. And then we're gonna go to the model village, so we aren't going very far. Oh, we can actually get the pine glass back. Yay! Is there Yay. Uh, are there any heavy draggables in the the village? Yes, yes, there are actually okay. a lot of heavy okay. draggables in the because village. Because it might be worth considering leaving the bucket next time, like, until you have a paired what, object to drag it what, back. What next time are you talking about? <laughs> the next time you run this category, don't you know? Oh, please don't speak like that, sir. In like a year? Two years? All right. Sir. Uh, okay. I'll get the boat. I have that. You want to get the boat? Okay, so this is our third and final pint glass. Toy so boat. far, none have broken. Chat is please. talking about the cork, by the way. What about the cork? Right. Let's we check the cork again, just to be sure. Okay, just you know, you know sure. what happened? No, I know what happened. Thank you, chat. Chat, chat's keeping us, keeping us like on track. Our, that is like our tracker. So she is, she is doing her job. Yes, very absolutely. Well. Shout out to yeah. the trackers. The most important job because I, it makes sure what, that this is valid. <laughs> I know what happens. Um. So we took a bunch of items and we dropped them through the the side mm -hmm. hole. And then the pub lady came down, and she must have taken the cork back. Because uh, we just didn't see it, because it's very tiny. Sorry yes. I said anything, but also not sorry. Keeping you yeah, honest. No, oh, we this, is, this is good. Like, we, we need the, the things, so... Uh, this is good. I don't know why she's chasing me. Okay. Good. So, right. actual last item. And the brilliant thing about taking all all of the items is that some NPCs kind of revolve around certain items, so they're just left in a very uh, uh, continuous oh, existential let me, crisis. Let me grab something real quick. I'm going to grab continue... a blue person. There okay, we go. Cool. Yeah, right. They'll continuously go back and forth and have like no idea because they can't do anything. They don't have any items to carry forward, so they just stare. They get very sad. Uh, we'll see that with Willy, especially uh, in the garden. Cork. It's just they reminisce about a time when they had, you know, things. I remember uh, did you having split, possessions. By the way? Well, I did split. Okay. So yeah, so there's a bunch of draggables uh, right here. Do uh, we want to get deep in there? No, we usually go front to back. Oh. Uh, okay. Oh wait. Random assortment. Go. Uh, I mean, okay, we're, we're grabbing the same thing. Stop. <laughs> so you we. Oh no. Uh, I, yeah, I just there need you. Go. Cool. All right. This is why we go front to back, though, um, ah. because stuff gets caught. So we have okay. the. Uh, this is, I think, the mail or the the water sprinkler, and yeah. the high street mini bench. Yeah, I think that's the high street pump. Yeah. yeah. So the there are the fewest number of items in the model village, but a lot of them are draggables. Uh, can I get this in? There we go. Got it in without going in myself. And somehow these geese are able to rip them from their very foundation. We are girthy. We're strong geese. I mean, we phase through fences. Do you think, like, small, heavy objects are going to stop us? They're not going to stop Absolutely us. Absolutely not. No. No one's uh, going to stop the geese. Grab mini willy. Okay. Oh, okay. I grabbed him. <laughs> Pass. What? How dare? How dare you? <laughs> I, 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 did I grab your mini willy? You order me to do a task, and you're like, and then you grab it for it was me? An, it was an accident. I meant to grab the miniature shovel, and I do missed. Do this thing for me. <laughs> do it. I'm sorry. Never mind. I'll do it. Since you're, since you're point zero it one a, it seconds was, slow. It was an accident. <laughs> I grabbed the wrong item. Grab the bench. Uh, Let's at least yeah, get this ye yeeted out. Um, yeah, you start there. I got this thing. Okay. Because yours is draggable and mine's not, so you being in front. Yeah. Arter's fine, though. Yeah, so that's actually one of the nice things is that draggable items still move quickly in water. Um, oh, thanks. Buoyancy <laughs> or something. Yeah. So you'll see when they drag them, they'll go as far across the water before reaching the shore as they can before finally dragging it, it on. 
It doesn't really help because uh, there isn't like large horizontal swaths of water or vertical swaths of water that we can really take advantage of, but yeah. It is nice. We already got the mini goose. Okay, do you uh, want to get, get, get the? No, I'll get this because it was behind. Okay, then I'll get mail carrier. Oh, I thought you were going to get grandma. Did no. not know you could rip the door off. Yep. So mail carrier, carrier says eight. Phone booth door. Uh, we only have eight items in the home area. Right now, we're just bringing a lot of stuff into the water. So this is um, crap. Yep. Staging. Our, our like... tracker has a lot of it noted, but it doesn't count until items get home. This is like washing the vegetables before uh, before you start like cooking them. Yes. And actually, we are, we are washing the vegetables in this case. So. Uh, and the clothes. So it's just that. The is there anything small? Should... No, oh. everything is is draggable here. So let me grab the easel. Uh, okay. So you also can take these items. Um, wait, what are you doing? Yeah, you can take these items through the model pub and over, kind of like. Uh, I did for the bell at the end of main game. I'm stuck. Um, however, there are a lot of places to get stuck um, in the model village. It's really, really easy for your items to just have geometry get in the way. So we, uh, so we have bird bath yep. and easel. Yep. Uh, do you want to grab the little old woman and I will grab um, the... Mini oh. Vinny? Yes. Okay. Uh, and push. Ooh, so already nice. we're getting a, like a nice little collection. It's going to just look amazing once we have it all just I cannot together. wait. I, it's we, really fun seeing all the <laughs> items from everywhere just collect. It's, it's a very good thumbnail screenshot. <laughs> um, so we also have some strats in terms of moving the items in the water as well. So you guys will get to see that uh, at some point. You're oh, stuck. I'm stuck. Thank you. <clears throat> um, one thing to know about Model Village, though, is that we're not going to get all the items in Model Village. We're going to leave going a to handful leave of one. Yeah, one particular one. one because yeah. Can anyone guess what the one item we are going to leave is? Oh, I know well, what it well, is. Well, I'm asking well, yeah, chat. You know. <laughs> it does chat. Do you know what <sighs> the one item is that we are not going to take? It literally kill your run if you even touch it. <laughs> oh. It can change the world around us essentially. What? I don't know. Is it the bell? It is the bell. It is the bell. Ah. There's an item kind of out of view on the left there. Yeah, do you want to grab a uh, little Timmy? Oh. Or whatever's on the left? Yeah, Timmy. little Timmy. Yeah, so the bell is the last item that we will take uh, at the very end of the run because it changes the world state when you... Uh, when you grab the bell, and it would make things very, very, very different. I see. Uh, Let's yeah. leave the red person in here as well because the gate will close. We'll need so to get it, out. So the bell got reset yes. from where? Because we did turn in their bell originally. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So, it so got but the bell always respawns back. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I guess Do it we... goes in with the lore of the game, where like there's a whole bunch of bells already in the pit. So it's kind of like yes, yes, yes. saying that there's there's always more bells Eternal and stuff. Bells. So, right. Yes. So we're leaving. We're also going to leave that red guy uh, because when we grab the bell, we're going to have to do that clip again. Um, and so because of that, we need an item for both of us, for each of us to have. So we're going to leave those two items. We actually could do it with just the bell where one person clips through and then clips the bell back for the second person. But that's slower, most likely. Yeah, that wasn't fun to do during uh, during one of our practice <laughs> hundos. It is a backup strat uh, that you can do in 100%. So this should be the last item, and the tracker confirms. So we are officially done moving stuff into water. We are now going to move everything that we take straight home. All uh, right, moving part two. Part yep. three, I guess. One was the house, and then here, and now, now we're going home. 
Yep, part three. Uh, we need that flower that we moved before. Right. Uh, so basically, there's, there is a really cool trick uh, that we do because the groundskeeper, Willy, is very aggressive and he gets in the way when we're trying to take all of his stuff. Uh, so we're just going to despawn him. Do you want to get his keys? Yep. Okay. Cool. Uh, where should I put the keys? I don't know. Uh, you need to leave the keys for him somewhere because he is gonna. We need to leave them in an area. So I would just put them in the briar patch. I'm just gonna leave that there. Wait, nope, that's too close. That's too. Yeah, you uh, can reach it. Okay, so now it's fine. So he's gonna stare at that and get all sad. Um, <laughs> but then it's fine. Oops. So yeah, leave that directly, like in there. Yeah. So basically, yeah. we're do we're doing this and taking his hat because we need his other hat. Um, we're gonna leave that there. We'll move it later. Um, and we need that hammer up there. So we're taking like all of this stuff. Do you wanna come down and like grab a carrot maybe when he comes yeah. back? Okay. It is so, possible to snatch that hat off of the wall without Willie's help, but it is very hard to do. So we're, we're just trying to make our life easy. Gosh, darn it. He wasn't Why? supposed to see this stuff. Psychic. He is. He's got eyes in the back of his head. All right, so we're just let's just take this stuff home, take it fully home. Uh, we have we have the the trowel and one carrot. They are now home. This is where we are we are going to start to bring items uh, faster. All right, so he's going for his hat now, so that's good. No, we don't want to do this stuff yet. We all want right. we want him to do all of his stuff. It's like deja vu uh, all over again. Yeah. Except very, very. So after this, he's he's gonna. I'm just moving it to get it. Are you kidding? Did he really just him. do that? Yep. Yeah. That's there we crazy. Go. So basically, I'm just moving stuff to get it like closer. So just little micro movements and stuff because otherwise we're just standing around um oh wait we needed the trout what did i what did we do why did i do that we Let's specifically need the trowel back that was really dumb you know there's a lot to keep track of there really is <laughs> okay so we have to go and bring that back good work hiding that that was helpful so we didn't put that away. Yep. Uh, okay. So we. Oh wait. There's no reason to stop. Grab the apple. Grab that yep. apple. Grab an Take apple. That. And then grab the trowel. So. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops. As, as I said, we've never done this before together. So. Okay. So add little... Willie's wide brim hat. Add one apple. So, remove one yeah. trowel. Sun, sun hat. Is. Where did you put the trowel? Uh, nope. That's a I goose. I put it over here. There okay. So yeah. So we need this because this is what's actually going to let us despawn him. And so me taking that was was uh, bad. <laughs> Lesson learned. Yeah. Okay. So we're we're actually gonna we have everything we need from him. Um. To grab his keys, get him to see those, please. Where? Is it? Oh yeah. There you are in the bush. Yep. Yeah, they should be right there. Yeah. So we need him to see it, the keys. Um. But we don't want him to take them back. Because I can't get just past before, him. He just sees before you. He sees you. Okay. Okay. So this is good. This is what we want. We want him to aggro on keys. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the trowel. Oh, Timmy's Timmy's <laughs> stuck. I forgot about down, Timmy. <laughs> down, child. Uh, so we're not going to get him to buy this back, but we want him to see it. Okay. Grab grab an item. I'll grab the plane. Yep. So he's gonna slowly walk back to the garden. He's gonna get. He's gonna take his keys, or we're actually gonna take his keys so he can't take them. Um, and then he is going to come back and he's gonna despawn himself. That's what, the goal. I can't have at least. fun ta taking the plane back. That's the goal. The goal is that he will he will go back and try to get his spade, and then will therefore despawn everything. So we have uh, we have his keys, and we have the toy plane from High Street. 
Uh, I wouldn't leave it right there. You, you don't want to leave anything right in the middle. You want to leave stuff against the walls as yep. much as possible. Make room. That makes sense. Yeah, because you're going to have to bring a bunch of stuff. All the big items. <laughs> yeah. It's just, so, it's just 200 plus items. All the small stuff fits like pretty easily against walls. Uh, you want to yeah. get the basket. Uh, so we yeah. don't want to go into the garden quite yet. Uh, we're going to do that after. So he's uh, yeah. So he's up. doing stuff, which is fine. He will, I promise you, he will despawn himself. Ooh, Ooh I got the radio, got the radio too. Radio. Nice. You lost a sandwich. How dare you, sir? Negative points. So we have uh, the basket, one sandwich half, the radio, and one piece of mulch. <laughs> that was a Fun good tip. haul right here. The so mulch? we want to drag these further back. Yeah, uh, we want to bring these pretty far back because these are draggables, um, and there there are going to be a decent number. And especially, all right, yeah, you're you have like room, so there we go. Get that out of the way, and we're gonna keep going. The mulch is one of the best like flotation devices in the game. You can surf on them. They're super. You fun could. Uh, the surfing doesn't work nearly as well since the co-op update. Uh, For whatever reason, something something got changed slightly with the physics. And it doesn't work any, as well anymore. Um, all right, so Sad. we have the other... Let the geese what? surf. Let the geese surf. They deserve it. Yeah, yeah. When when we discovered surfing, it was a lot of fun for a few days. Much Beach Boy was played. Uh, but yeah, the, for whatever reason, the co-op update slightly changed physics, and it doesn't work nearly as well. Add shovel, add one bag of mulch. More plain sounds, thunder. Chat demands. <laughs> Here, you gotta make the wings though too. Oh yeah, I mean, leave, leave geese it, can fly. Leave, yeah, leave God, the. I couldn't uh, imagine the if, the, if you could fly in this game. That'd be terrifying. Uh, let's let's go through. Make sure he's gone. Kisses. Wow. Yeah, he's so he's gone. Cool. We cool. got him. Do you want to take the mallet? Uh, sure. Uh, oh, do you great. see the and and so there there is one no, uh, notoriously horrible item in this run. It, uh, and that we are, uh, you want to do that next? Yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> let's All right, do so it. Let's, We're going to have to we'll, do it eventually. Yeah, we have to find our, um, our supply pieces to help with it. Yes. So we have a rake in the lake, and we have a sign in the lake. It's also in, uh, one of the worst posi starting positions, too. Uh, because the item gets moved by Willy, so it can be in a bunch of different spots. <clears throat> This is the rare example of a large, hard-to-move item not getting pushed all the way to the back. All right, uh, try to find a newspaper or a plate. Mm, right, I found a plate. Newspaper. Yep, there's a plate up above in the middle. There's the paper. Yep. Okay. Good, good work pushing stuff. Much better than I did. Newspaper. Okay. We are going to move the planter. If <sighs> this takes less than five minutes, we've done a good job. Oh, no. Uh oh. Yep. For this one item, it is the one item that you cannot grab. Yep. Oh, oh, this I mean, is gonna be pain. Grab the the, the soccer ball cabbage. either or cabbage. Oh, yep. but, so, oh, uh, but those move a lot easier. Look at that. That's so smooth. Thunder. So yeah, far. You're, it's, you're doing great. Uh, that's a, this that's is impressive. impressive. This is well done. Yeah. Coordination. This, this is going well. This Coordination is a good start. at its finest. Well. This is what you come to see co-op runs for. Pushing yeah. a planter. <laughs> Through a garden. And, and then we'll grab through, through, object. through, oh, through no. a lake and then up a hill. I can't see it. <laughs> Slight problem. Uh, we can zoom in a little bit for this. Close up. Yeah. I love the close up. I'm I'm here for it. <laughs> this is this is by far the hardest item to move. Oh, uh, uh, why is there a slope? Yeah, so this is the down slope portion. Don't try not to get it onto the um, the bench. The I bench, don't want yeah. to. Uh, okay, move it to the right. <laughs> okay, oh, so you know what? I'm just gonna let you go there first, and then I'll follow. So something else uh, we didn't actually mention at the beginning. So Thunder and I are where this is local co-op. Uh, Thunder and I are on the other side of the country from of the United States from each other. So we are playing local co-op through Parsec, uh, which basically means that Thunder has some lag and I do not. So any mistake that Thunder makes is because of lag and any mistake that I make is because I'm bad at the video game. I just want to make sure that that is that everyone knows that and that is out there. 
None of Thunder's <laughs> mistakes are his fault. All of my mistakes are my fault. Okay, good to know. Wow. Good to know. I'm taking notes on this. I like that the planter can actually reach the bottom of the lake and sit up. Uh, don't try not to get it in the corner yeah, on I, the way up. It's, I don't it's want really to get hard. in the corner. <laughs> yeah, it's really hard to get it up the, from there. Okay. So, all right, we're almost done with the lake portion. Uh, and we're coming up on the upslope portion. Uh, probably the hardest part. Uh, like the first couple of pieces up here. But we have two of us, so this actually is making it a lot easier. Yeah, this than is one. going remarkably I well. I don't know if anyone in chat is timing this, but like single player, this is a five to six minute item by itself. Um, it's one of oh, the ones that you just barely get it across the fence and you're like, good enough. Yeah, we're, the goal is to get it on the left side, the left side of the fence. And as soon as it's past the fence, Stop that's, that's it. it. We're, we're done. Almost there. No, oh, all right. You're, you're, you. Just got a wedge the newspaper right in. Just tap it in. All right, it's in. Great job. Go. All oh, right. Plants uh, are the plant okay. Where are you nope. going? Drop the your newspaper. Are the, newspaper's an important cleaning item. It is and really we, good for sweeping the lake. Yeah, use another plate. And the trash, <laughs> the trash lid is still better. All right. Oh yeah. Yeah. So the, the tr but yeah. Sorry, we're it, it's it's not worth pulling it back out. Uh, carrots. Carrots. All right, two two carrots. Time to get some stuff I'm for right. dinner. All right, bringing bringing over some carrots from the garden. Lovely. Willie's done us a great service. Mm-hmm. So we are done with the planter. The hard part is out of the way. So we can just leave these like right there on the inside. Um. Again, for, for those who are coming in, took two minutes and 50 seconds. Nice. That was very good. Then. I like that. <clears throat> our only, our, our requirement is to get it past the gate. Um, another fun thing about this is uh, everyone is going to get to see double, double butt cabbage. Double butt cabbage. No, no, no. Double, no. double. Double, double butt cabbage. I did not stutter. It's true. There are indeed and four cabbages and four perfect tools for pushing cabbages. Yep. Also known as pumpkins. Yes. First, it will be a first on GDQ, uh, right. as none of the prior runs have had the glory that is butt cabbage. I was I would I, I was going to offer you an extra fifty dollar donation if you did butt cabbage. <laughs> in the co-op. That's right. No, I think it was in no. the the first one though. Oh, just just ancillary. It's, just do yeah. some cabbage it's, for it's the my, fun of it. It's yes. <laughs> it's my favorite. It's my favorite like technique in the game. Is, is the it's fact a that fun technique. It, well, there's a reason why it, it's, I love yeah. that move. That is a that is a Ritz Blues special. Uh, okay, Ritz. So we we have... love it so much. Tass and I have emotes that complement each other for it. Yes. Uh, I have I have a goose tush emote, and Thunder has a cabbage emote. So if you guys want your own butt cabbage emotes, <laughs> subscribe to both of these runners. Incredible. Do it, you know, that's, that's a great the opportunity duo. for me to say you should follow both of these fantastic runners, and I just put it in the chat. So do it. Thank you. Uh, so we have nine carrots done. We have one left, uh, but let's uh, not get it yet, maybe. I don't no, know. There's let's other get stuff. Something. Or you no, get, get the tulip. carrot. Yeah, yeah, get the carrot. I got the tulip. That works. Uh, okay, so we have Tulip and the final 10th car carrot. Um, also, I don't know if uh, Tech is able to show the full tracker. I don't know if that's something that they were going to do or planning to do. If not, I won't talk about it. But uh, if so, might be a, a cool time to show it for the first time. I think we're just going to have the, the, the number go up. Okay. But okay. we'll we'll see it Never go up then. real fast, like yes. at, you know, once we're dumping all these items in, it's 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 happening. Yeah. Do not close the gate. Yeah. Uh, grab the. I'm not going to close the gate. <laughs> grab grab the the thing. <laughs> the watering the, can. Yeah. The watering can. Yeah. Uh, if the gate closes, we are in serious trouble because we <laughs> I mean, can't open it. But we, we can't go out the little... side hole. Yeah. This, that would lose that would lose time. Yeah. Um, until we release. Uh, well, we know because we Willie doesn't have his nope. keys, nope. so he you'd, can't. You'd have, have to do. You'd have, to, have do to do all of High cabbage. Street. Yeah, yep. and all of High Street through the the side hole. That's a terrifying which thought. Which wouldn't be fun. Uh, all right, so we have the wooden crate. 
and the watering can. Watering can. We don't actually need, we, we probably don't need to go that far back. This is like probably as far as we have to go from uh, all of the previous times that we've done this solo. Would there be any value to handing items off in a relay? No, because we have a proximity limiter. Um, like yeah. we, we have to be within a certain range of each other at all times. Co-op runs of this game would be dramatically different if you didn't, uh, if you weren't forced to be on the same screen. Yeah, if it became split screen, I'm sure it would be really interesting. But the whole the whole run would be different. Yep. Uh, so you can actually see that there are a couple of items that are heavier than most draggables, uh, yep. like this, like the water cooler, the cooler that I have. Um, another is the shopping cart Basket. in yep. uh, High Street. And I think those might be the only two that are like extra heavy yep. uh, mm -hmm. without anything else in them, but they they move slower. Uh, couldn't you put items in the basket and create and use them to drag? Yes, but then they become slower uh, if you put items into it. So because of the fact that we're both moving items and we're moving at kind of the same speed, for most of this, it doesn't necessarily make sense. Um, yeah. Can you yeah, grab the other time. side of it? Okay, yeah. you got it. If yeah. you had like... so it. Well, if you grab the other side, it'll move faster. Yep. Oh, now that right. it doesn't really matter now, but... I yeah. helped there. See, I can say I helped. Thank you for helping. Yay! Yeah. Yeah. So if you had, for... say, two boxes that were both very close to one another, you could load each of them with, say, yes. two objects, and then both geese could be dragging boxes full of yeah. stuff at the same time. Yeah. Uh, butt cabbage? Yep. And, yeah. and, and the thing, again, too, is, like, I think we you explained it earlier, but, like, the more items are in a box or, like, that, the uh, heavier the it, uh, it will actually be. So there, there does become a point where, like, it becomes slower just to, like, put items and then drag it. Actually, I think there's a point where you can't even drag it. Yep, I think it's at, like, four items uh, that you can't drag it at all. Oh, I'm are you, rusty Are you on having this. some trouble? I'm a little like bit someone rusty. needs more practice with their butt cabbage. I so do. You, it sounds like I need more hundos to do. Uh, all right, well, because of that, I got stuck in the in the weeds, the reeds here. Okay, so this is butt cabbage. We, um, we move the cabbage with our butt while dragging a pumpkin. Yeah, yeah. Um, For whatever oh reason, you're more mobile when you're dragging something than uh, like your body positioning is more mobile than if you're just walking. Normally when you walk, it's almost like tank controls. Really fast, smooth tank controls, but still tank controls. I can't believe you just gave up on your cabbage. I see, sir. A, I see a butt with no cabbage. I cannot oh, believe you just gave up on that. <laughs> that Thunder, was very got, impressive. You, what a good strat. You got yeah. one. You what? got one more shot. <laughs> yep. Second try. Uh, lag. I'll, I'll claim that. <laughs> you claim. Uh, who originated butt butt cabbage? Ritz did. Uh, our wonderful commentator, Ritz Blues. I absolutely love this. Like it's it's one of my favorite like discoveries in this game. It's such a small thing, but it's just. There's something funny. graceful and elegant and funny about it. Sorry. That is like the best strat name in the game. I mean, it's literally what we're doing. Like, it's the appropriate name. I haven't done I haven't done this in forever either. But yeah, likewise, <laughs> yeah. Because <laughs> I, I haven't run Hundo. Nor, the only category that this is really done in is the single player hundred percent. Yep. Uh, it's it's. Oh, I'm getting stuck now on stuff. Please don't get uh, stuck. It's not done in co-op Hundo. Which is why it was not shown at GDQ uh, last year when we did co-op Hundo together. Man, now okay, okay, now I'm having trouble. Uh huh. Mm -hmm, I made it look mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. easy last time. Uh huh. I'm sorry. Where are you going the wrong way now? <laughs> yeah, I'm just going back so and the, forth. Okay, so the the thing about the cabbage is the um, the model for the cabbage is the combination of both a square and a sphere. So when you push it, it kind of has a mind of its own um, and it will go wherever the hell it wants. As yeah. opposed to like the soccer ball, where the soccer ball is just a sphere. So it kind of rolls normally like you would expect with a sphere. Can we? We are um, at four pumpkins, see, three let's, cabbage. Yeah, let's uh, get this. Yeah, just get that out of the way a little bit. It's yeah. fine. We, it's, we're, you're good as it is. Um, so yeah, so the cabbage is significantly harder to move than the soccer ball because it doesn't move where you want it to move. 
it moves where it wants to move. The nice thing about this part of the category, though, is the hill. There's a that that uh, bank off of the side of the lake is a hill that dumps cabbages into the lake. I'm sure any of you who played this casually found that out the hard way. Uh, but luckily, these two want that to happen in order to get it. it you know, except across. it's then sloped on the other side. So this right here is a downslope that we're on, and then we cross the lake, and then it is an upslope. It is very difficult to see that given the, the flat textures of the game. Two boots coming in. Two boots. Two waders. Yeah. Uh, so we're getting close to being done with uh, garden. With, with garden. <laughs> Finish right? that sentence, nice. please. <laughs> All right. Yeah, with garden, not <laughs> with with the run. There's no. still an hour <laughs> or so left. That would be an impressive uh, record, wouldn't it? It would be a very impressive record. Is this is this all we with these four items? Uh, uh, but is looks, there, any, there might be some items hiding is there anything in here. Do you see anything in here? No, I don't see any question marks. So I think that's. That's it. I think these are the last things we have. I don't uh, think I've ever grabbed that mug. Yep. Uh, so we have the, the little mug and the, another apple. Can we stop rolling stuff with our back? Uh, I think we're but done it's with it. efficient. With, yeah. We're, I think we're done with it right now. I don't yeah. think there's any more um, tushy movements. Uh, I mean, there's a cabbage out there, so we might. I, well, yeah, but I assume you're gonna use that. We're gonna, you're gonna push it with your chest while holding another item. Maybe, maybe I'll just okay. get one of the signs. Who knows? Yeah, you could. Yeah, you could. Uh, uh, so yeah, I think this. Oh, oh no, no, no. We have a sand bat. We have a, a mulch uh, up here. Hold oh, on. Let me yeah, grab the mulch. You. Yep. The mulch. Uh, almost forgot that. Our war, our lone additional. Oh, are you gonna try to do the twofer here? Kind of. Are you gonna juggle them? Kind of. Hold on. Can I? I was gonna try to push one. Oh, can you put it on the mulch? Can you? That's can you a brilliant place... idea. There you go. Uh, go, uh, go. 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 Nice. Let's go. Nice. We're jamming now. Baby. On Discovering the fly strats. That's clean. Live strats. We have one uh, jam have or jelly. Thermos uh, jam. Thermos. And the last mulch. And the last mulch. Uh, yeah, so the only thing we're missing is the trowel, but the, but we know we're missing the trowel because that is what we use to despawn Willy. Uh, okay. That's good. So a lot of the issue actually with moving those draggable items in is getting back out because you wind up like pushing them out as you're going. Yep. You, um, have to, you have to corner yourself to get it in. Yeah, so like maneuvering yourself so that you get around them is actually like an important part of everything. Uh, so we're going to free Willy. <laughs> like the whale. Oh my goodness. Like the whale. Oh, I got to actually see the screen. Oh, OK. OK, I got to open uh, my eyes. Do you want to grab these? Or, OK, well, no, uh, we'll take that later. Uh, yeah. So That's he should. Yes, yeah, so there you go. So he's buying his thing back. Uh, I'm going to take the broom. Do you want to take the shopping cart? Uh, yes. Negotiations so this are is, This is a good time to do that because she is uh, distracted. Hopefully. Nope, she sees. Or oh, she doesn't. Nope. nope. Easy. Okay. She, the one, one of the items she never moves is that shopping basket. She'll take stuff out of it, but she'll never move that basket. Yeah, because it's another one of the uh, extra heavy items. Uh, oh, God. So, so that might and the be thing a about goose job getting that on that curb. Uh, so the thing, no, I, I, I know you can do it. I mean, I've, I've done it enough times in solo, all items. Um, so oh. the, the broom can break, obviously. Um, and so grabbing the broom cleanly, uh, excuse me. Excuse, sir, where are sir. you going? <laughs> sir, are you, where are you going? <laughs> sir, please leave me alone. Uh. Yeah, so NPCs are sticky. <laughs> oh, Willy, move! That's not moving. <laughs> okay. Uh, you need your item, though. I know. Okay. Okay. Um, We're good. So yeah. So like grabbing the broom without the shopkeeper's aggroing on it means that you can take two pieces of an item at once versus uh, having to do them separately. I, so I have a fun fact about the broom. 
And those of you who have seen some of the behind the scenes videos on how this game was made, it turns out that the broom does not actually break in half. The broom wow. is actually one of three broom related items. There is a broom handle, a broom brush, and a full broom. And there's an item hidden. There's a, there's a, a, there's a I just... bush somewhere in the, in the world that's hiding the other two pieces of the broom. And when you make the shopkeeper break the broom, it swaps positions with both the either fixed broom or the two pieces of the broken broom. Nick, okay. Nick, your way over there. All right. Made so it. the broom and the shopping cart are in. So technically, there's still two pieces that you can never have. Well, it's the same thing with uh, the box in pub as well. Uh, yeah. There's a number of items like that that are just outside of that are out of bounds and that they swap in and out. Yeah, and now, uh, now Willie's just gonna oh you hide the trowel, I guess. Yeah, may as well. We'll take it later, but might as well hide it. Um, Willie's about to have a heck of a time trying to find what his purpose is in life now, um, since he has nothing of material value remaining in his garden. Yep. He's he's just gonna sadly wander. He's going to wander, and he's going to wonder. And we'll continue to torment Timmy uh, as we go. As, as well, he's you tradition. Should. Yep. He's helped end plenty of hundo runs, so. So we have justified. Uh, two other of the gardening tools from High Street. Any gardening experts know what the one that Tasselfoot is holding? It looks kind of strange. I'm, I'm, I zoomed in. If anyone wants to try to, I mean, it, it, honestly, it, it looks like a fork that you would use for like grilling. Yeah, but there's That's, like this weird metal plate halfway down. Yeah, the shaft. there's like a velociraptor head attached to it. You know, with like the the neck flail out and stuff. The sort of a, you, you know what I'm talking about. You mean Dilophosaurus? Velociraptor. You know, like Jurassic Park. Yeah, I know Jurassic Park. It's a weed fork, as per chat. Uh. So if you want to eat your weeds, you need your weed fork. It's uh, only polite. I'm get, grab a draggable, grab the baby or something if you can. Or, the, or yeah, or that, an umbrella. Uh, so the other reason to grab the broom early, you just saw right there, um, when you go into shopkeeper's shop and she sees you, she'll try to grab her broom to go and like sh shush you and, and push you out. But with the broom not being there, she gets all upset and wondering where it is. And that stall time is enough to like grab your item and get out of her shop without her interfering. So it is also really beneficial to grab the broom early in high street. Gonna be. Actually, is there any benefit to opening the umbrellas for dragging items through the lake? I have no idea. Don't know. Can you I've grab it through the handle? Yeah, yeah you can grab you, the other you, okay, handle yeah. for sure, yeah. and it would open it up. I mean, I'm used it might, to just popping it open, and that's it might make for a decent is. sort of like scoop. It might. It might. I have not tried. I feel like it might be We're, a little more difficult because you're going backwards and have to constantly readjust. Yeah, you're, you're trying to like uh, drag it across versus um, if you use like the garbage lid, uh, then you're able to push it and control it better, I would think. Down boy. Down boy. Uh, do you want to try to grab the other umbrellas? Yes. Okay. Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Oh, yeah. If she's gonna, perfect, if she's gonna let us be oh, free with it. Yeah, free. Nice. All right. All right. I love the, the strategy of y'all figuring out just based on the I'm stuck. people's positions, but what you, you know, how all the items act, what order you're grabbing everything. It's really fun to watch. Well, you lose enough runs uh, of this game trying to sneak these things away just in a, uh, a normal hundo run, and you, rec you learn to recognize the positioning and like 
whether or um, not you can get away with it. Yeah. The the trowel is currently hiding. It's in yeah. the potato patch. Um, which, fun fact, the that big thing of, of bushy plants and stuff, uh, th those are potatoes. 100% um, confirmed, because I watched a talk by the devs talking about the design of the game, uh, and it, that, that information was just casually dropped in there, and it kind of blew my mind. Oh yeah, I think you were like so happy about that, you messaged me. I swore there was like who something- Who else am I gonna tell? That's true. <laughs> That's... But yeah, I, I think I posted it in the Discord and stuff. I was like, oh my god, guys, new information. Lore, it's lore potatoes. has dropped. <laughs> Hot goose yeah. lore. There's a lot of goose lore. Oil them, mash them, stick them in a stew. He is very upset that his trowel is not there. I think he's and he's now entered crisis mode where he doesn't know what to do with himself. He's 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 kind of in denial. I feel. You know what? Yeah, I, I don't think I, he's I gotten to anger yet. And he'll keep on going back and forth. He'll keep on thinking that like maybe maybe he'll be back. Okay. Oh, we're not taking. Okay, yeah, we're fine. No, it's way too. I was quick. thinking um, if we can, we can get the baby and the race car because those are both draggable. Yes. Uh, probably when she was in better the position. Race car is carryable, isn't it? Maybe. Maybe. I don't remember. <laughs> Maybe uh, oh, we'll I don't know what out. other drag. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, we can take not. the calculator. I thought yeah, the race right. car was draggable, but it might yeah. not be. If if not else, the calculator is definitely a draggable. Actually, right. the race car might be draggable because I think you can like pull it back and let it go, and it zips down the street. Oh, I yeah. have never seen that before. You haven't seen that? Oh, it's nope. fun. You should try. I it. feel like we need to do it. Not right now. Okay, that's true. It works better though. Later. Like uh, Hair, hairbrush and blue can. Okay. It works better if you drag it on like the street behind, you know, back by pub behind uh, back garden. Like, yeah, because that's, that's like a quarter mile strip, right? So we're drag racing. Right. Kind of wish there were two cars so that you guys could have like goose drag races. House house, new uh, new DLC. Please. Do you wanna do you wanna grab the um the walkie talkies? Yes. We're gonna see how much time we would devote to that if that did happen. Yeah. A lot. Yep. <laughs> We'd spend so much time having fun with that. A, that would be an entire category. So you can honk in one walkie-talkie and the other one responds. We haven't found anything speedrun useful with these. It's just a little bit out of the way and like... I don't know. If you, it's nice to know that you could maybe leave one of them next to uh, Timmy and just keep him like under control there uh breaker breaker 10-4 roger over okay <laughs> yeah, it's honestly ingenious how some of the sound design works for some of these items like you can hear the walkie talkie there's a bit of static uh the bottles have their own sound effect the trash can lid uh, which yeah. you might have heard earlier me going Road nuts cone. with yeah. Yes. The, the walkie-talkies are useful in stealth percent, where you have to complete the game without the NPCs knowing that you were there, ever there. Although that's not a category that I'm really familiar with. I think it's the only category I've never run. Sounds very challenging. Seems more like a challenge run, you know? As very it, is, it is very challenging. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's challenge runs like... Um, this is a so, challenge run? At least, this is arguably a challenge run. Yeah, I would say so. Um, the um, the fewest honks possible is another... Uh, Grab the, the paper, blue paper, or, or not. Uh, cleaning fluid. Okay, that works. Something she's she's going to chase, though. She, uh, oh, or, okay, oh, she got distracted. She got, she got broomed. No, that was after the broom. I thought yeah. she was going to chase, but mm -hmm. for some reason... Uh, it must have been a co-op thing, like a two-use thing, because in, yeah, in a single player, on, yeah. it would have been all over you in single player. Yeah, which uh, is actually really interesting because if you have one of her items and run into the garden, she'll just sprint around to the other side. Yes, it's it's, it's really funny. She'll start running laps. Yeah, I actually like doing it's that. It's not funny if you're in a run, though. We have a, a can and a cleaning fluid cleaner. Yep. What, 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 kind of, what, what kind of canned good is that? I, th I think that's Hormel chili. Mystery meat. 
Uh, whatever the... What's the difference? Maybe it's Vegemite. Does that come in a can? Comes in a jar. Jar? I mean, the devs are Australian, so I would assume that something is Vegemite. Yeah. If you are getting chased by the shopkeeper uh, with an object in Hundo, though, it is kind of funny to duck into the garden and then quickly follow her. Kind of Scooby-Doo style, where, like, the bad guy winds up in front of you instead of behind you. Uh, okay. <laughs> yeah, we do... that broom again. Oh, go ahead. No worries. We do have some people coming on in who maybe have caught, missed the beginning of the run, but don't worry. This run's going to be available on YouTube tomorrow, so you'll be able to catch the whole thing if you're interested in how this run started. It started off with a 100% run, uh, and that was really interesting, and then seeing how we've gotten all the items to their, their best spots. And if you miss any of the shows on Hotfix, you can go to uh, Games Done Quick on YouTube and you can see everything there. Or if you're watching on YouTube, come and join us live on Twitch if you're interested in looking at our live content, which starts weeknights at 7 p.m. Eastern and weekends at 1 p.m. We got so many awesome shows of, of different kinds. Oh, look at that. A little butt cabbage action there. Ryan, um, it's, it's stuck. In the corner. Damn, darn it. I tried. I was trying to do it. Uh, right. Calculator hello. is coming in so we can do our taxes. And the baby. And, yep, and the baby. Come on, baby. Duh, baby. Okay, I guess that's that, I guess that's all. That's It's living there now. Don't worry, Australians aren't real. Ooh, that's a good question. Uh, what? Is, who is your favorite NPC? Hmm. That is a good question. Uh, for me, I like the uh, NPCs that are sitting at the table that you I was perform a, for. I was about to say exactly that, yeah. yeah. They are the nicest NPCs, unless you're doing any percent, because they will chase you with the bell. And then, yeah. well, any percent glitchless too. Um, uh, what items but do we have? They actually left? celebrate your goosey antics. Grab uh, the, the paper, I'll get the chalk. Yep. Just so we have to do all of the fruits and vegetables still, plus the, the two, there's two glasses, there's the items on the table. We still have a lot of stuff there's here, a, and then uh, all the stuff on the there. right. Yep, well, there's the glass bottle. Uh, so my, I think my favorite NPC is is Tina. Um, I appreciate that you know she's living in her own world. She she's not afraid to have like frog statues, duck statues. Like you know she is she is embracing herself. She is a a true to herself spirit, and I appreciate that about her don't let tass lie to you he curses her name in blood regularly during hundo <laughs> runs that's not the point that's irrelevant it's true you can you can you can like have a favorite npc but that doesn't mean that he like absolutely loves, uh, loves her. there were a lot of npcs we cur or we curse where are we going uh we need the the goose sign from outside of back garden still yes yep we we should grab that um, I'm gonna let's go and grab that, and then you can take the trash can while I'm doing that, since they're both draggable. Sounds How does good. that sound? It's good. Yeah, I mean, like, if you run this game enough, you're eventually gonna start. Like, you you curse the name you of hate every NPC. many NPCs because they, at one point or another, at least one every NPC has ended a run for you. <laughs> Like even even the nice ladies that you uh, do the uh, performance for, like in any percent, they have ended plenty of runs, at least in the early strats, the early day strats. Imagine running any percent. Shoutouts to BH. So, uh, so fun, fun fact. Squid. If you if you watch Tasselfoot's stream and get enough channel points, you too can force him to play any percent by uh. Contributing, I believe it's ten thousand channel points. 20. Twenty. Twenty. Oh, he bumped it up because we were getting nope. close. That's why. No, okay. it's always been twenty. Uh, okay. I, that's not bad. Uh, that's any, not too any, much. Any percent is is yeah. I, I don't like any percents. Uh, I like playing the game, and in any percent, you don't really play the game. So. Oh. I'm little helping. Help, little, little, give him a little helping booty. Please, yeah. this is like the worst sound. <laughs> Of just metal I, scratching upon. I actually am helping, asphalt. by the way. You're moving faster. 
than you otherwise yeah, would. I am moving a whole lot faster. This is incredible. <laughs> yeah. I wonder if it goes faster if both keys grab it. Uh, I think it would move at the same speed it's moving at right now, actually. Uh, okay. I, it might go a little bit slower because of us trying to... But go. I can't move the sign at the same time if I did that. Yeah. So, yeah, not, not so really whoever was it. asking in chat, apparently, yes, there are more booty strats. We just newly discovered hot and fresh off the presses. There we go. And that for trash your bag, consumption. That trash bag staying strong in there. Not not falling out of the can, the can at all. Uh, so also interesting, you might think like, well, why don't we just put items into the trash can and drag that? Um, when you knock the trash can over, it creates like an invisible wall inside of it. So you actually can't place any items in it. Uh, there were actually just, a couple. I, there were two apples in it, but I couldn't move the trash can. Yeah, so the, there are two apple cores uh, plus a toothbrush inside of it. So we will need to get those items, but we can't do that. Trash uh, can with... and back garden sign added. Yeah, and, uh, one of the no goose signs. That's fine. It's 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 yeah. good where it is. There we go. I got a little little more push. One of the difficult things about like when two geese grab an item, when you co-oply grab an item, one of the difficult things is. It, it involves extra coordination because you have to move together because if one goose is moving one way or just slightly like not forward or like back or just moving in a different direction uh the box like whatever you grab usually it's the box can just go all over the place and just stop or like jerk all over the place and it glasses. can move a little bit slower yep glasses she's gonna go for yeah yep Uh, so there's one more pair of glasses, uh, and then... Bruno. Careful about Timmy. Oh yeah, because he's gonna get yeah. up for glasses. <laughs> and right back down again. You try staying on your hands and knees in a puddle for over an hour. Poor kid. Shoes untied, no glasses. Timmy's not having a good day. He had to his... stretch his legs out for a second. His mom oh. is gonna be so mad at him. When he oh, gets and home. yeah, we also trapped him in uh, the uh, the garage, so that's another. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Garage and the phone booth. Uh, yeah. It, just not a good day. It's not every there's... day two geese come and steal two hundred of your village's items. I mean, what's a, what's a kid gonna do? Normally, it's just one item. Right. Uh, but it is every day. <laughs> yes. <laughs> And Sometimes some, it's every half hour. Some, some days they lie in wait, just wondering when when will it be uh, the purge of all the items? And it is. You want to get the table table items? Yes. You want to get the race car? Okay. Yeah, okay. So you, oh, it's, it's not a draggable. Good. Yeah. No. Nope. That's that's helpful. I was a little worried. So, but if you like body it, you can like roll it backwards, and it'll build up tension in the wheels, and it'll zip forward like those little toy cars do. I never knew that. I've not seen that a single time. Sounds like and, you uh, haven't had fun. Clear, clearly, I have not played this game enough then. Tess, you need another 500 hours of this. Twitch, Twitch says I've streamed over 600 hours of Goose, so... That's Double incredible. It. I love that for you. Speedrunner moment. In Imagine incredible what was... is, is one adjective for it, not necessarily the one I would have picked, but we can go with it. Imagine if we wrote Steam reviews now. I think I did write a Steam review for it. Does it display? Would it display like what it was at the time yep. or how many current? Both. It tell okay, uh, cool. Steam reviews say hours at time of re review and then hours current. Oh, that's cool. I yeah. thought it was just at the moment. Mm -hmm. It's both. A good way to uh, uh, ignore review okay. bombs. Yeah. So okay, time for fruit plus the last glasses. Uh, yes. Okay. I got stuck. Thank you for going for the fruit. Yeah, it was in front, so I would go the further distance. <clears throat> you All can right. unplug the boom box. It doesn't do anything other than distract her, but it is something that you can do. How long has poor Timmy been in the puddle? Uh, About since... an hour. 
since the uh, oh, no hour and a half at this point. Yeah, he's he's been there since post game, so that was like 20 minutes in to the I run. Bet, I bet you didn't know that kneecaps could get all pruny. I he's at the fine. Thought. He's fine. You can drown him in the lake, though. <laughs> okay, oh, that's no. a little. I mean, it's a little just, extreme like, of wordage you used. Well, I, you, I mean, you can have him in the same position, but the water's deeper. He can submerge so infer, underwater. He can submerge in the night there From that, go. what you will. He can be like a submarine. Like, first he's above water, and then he's below it. And then he's he comes back up again. embracing his inner Jeremy. There you go. Yeah, uh, Timmy is like the one NPC that you, you arguably can have the most control over and can put him in almost anywhere in the game. He just doesn't go like to the pub pretty much. Uh, well, yeah, because he's the only NPC that like uh, is afraid of you and will run away from you, whereas all other NPCs will chase you. We have a, a tomato and an orange. Yes. Hi, Willie. Excuse me, sir. Still, still looking for his lost items. Maybe, maybe one day he'll he'll forever, get them back. Forever forced to roam. Wink. Kisses. Mwah. Kisses. <laughs> so that's just something that randomly happens based on proximity. It's not like there's a button they can do to do that. But it's nice yeah. that they do it. Yep. The little and it kind of makes them feel real. Yeah, and it kind of functions like if there's an item, like usually there's an item there so the goose head can lean there too. Uh, which can be good or bad, depending on what you're trying to do. If you're trying to um, be side by side, grabbing something at the same time, you can grab it out of your partner's mouth or beak instead. Yep. So for the items, the fruits and veg on the right side, uh, we'll, we'll go outside of the shop and just go around. It'll it'll lose a tiny bit of time, but because there's two of us, it makes it a little bit safer. And in the long run, safety is important. Yes. Because if shopkeeper chases you to the ends of the earth, it can be a problem if she's just, you know, just walking down the alleyway we've been going back and forth in and completely yeah. halts your progress for oh, quite some time. Oh, that would be, yeah, that'd be rough. It's, it's not usually an immediate problem because like we said, uh, she runs around to the front of the garden. It's usually like two trips later She'll be slowly walking back through that uh, pathway, and if you have an item from her shop, she will then aggro on it from you, and it becomes a, a problem. So, uh, the goal is to not let her aggro. And oddly enough, okay, oddly enough, she can go in the garden. This was a that was a during one of my runs. That was a communication thing that. I was so confident in, like, oh, she can't go in garden. She can go in garden. She's just stopped by an invisible wall um, at the um, at the area between. Uh, uh, this is this is what we were trying to avoid. Okay, we, should we, I drop in let, and grab it? Uh, from go ahead and pre uh, press on, because the, what you can do is grab the trash well, out of the trash can, and she won't chase you in your follow-up. This is this should be fine. Also, if I her. grab it from her, she'll then not turn around again. Or maybe oh, she, she turned. Okay. She turned for the carrot. All right, no, uh, she's gonna take the Scooby Doo loop. Yeah, no, she stopped. No, short. She stopped. We're fine. All right, okay, we're cool. we're chilling. Uh, yeah. So, uh, also NPCs have different run speeds. Um, like Willie and Vinny. Uh, so the 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 guy in garden and the bouncer in pub uh, are both pretty fast. They will catch up to you in, in short order. Um, the shopkeeper is slightly very very ever so slightly slower than you uh so if you have something like that you can actually lose her uh and timmy is the slowest if timmy is chasing you 
um, and you're just holding run, he will he will lose you pretty quickly. So you have to like slow down if you want him to chase you intentionally, like for the toy plane get and getting him trapped in the garage. Goose facts. Goose facts. Uh, okay. So yeah, so that was a problem, and she chased because we left her garden while she was near us and while she was looking at us. So if Did we had just stayed inside her shop, I said garden, I meant shop. Yeah, I was if we had just stayed until she turned and then left, it would be fine, just like that. So that's actually what the issue was: is that we left her shop uh, while she could still see us. So that so then she immediately started chasing instead of going to the broom. Yeah. For like a general area on like what like where the shop is so there's the asphalt from the the road and all that it's the light it's the like lighter concrete area like that pretty much signals like that's the shop area so if you're in it um you're in the shop but if you step out of it yeah if you're in it she'll like she sees you and she'll go for broom if you're out of it she'll just immediately go for you so it's like a good visual in, in casual in case you want to know like when when is like the time she'll chase you and then the, versus the time she'll just go off and get the broom sir please excuse me uh, he's getting surly come on i didn't see you two do it but i know it was you it's always the case Always. Uh, nope. We definitely did not take his hammer. Nope, he has wasn't no proof. Us. Yeah. Hammer and garden. Who is the geese? So we get. Yeah, we want to be in the shop when she sees yeah. us take stuff. Okay. So the last of the carrots and the last of the celery. We yeah, and then it's the orange and then the cucumbers slash zucchini. You can grab Was, the zucchini. Huh. Yeah, you can grab it? all of those. There's yeah. three of each, uh, and there's five different ones. So. That would be 15, uh, by my math. Correct, correct me if I'm wrong on that one. Three by five, yeah. <laughs> I don't have enough fingers for that, though. So, you know, it's tough. Is it just me or does I Jeremy do. keep moving? Jeremy he keeps does. on moving. You're not, you're not wrong. Okay, thought I was Jeremy... going crazy for a second, which no. I might, but maybe not for that reason. No. Jeremy might become, might be starting to get sentient. Uh-oh. We left him in the water too long. It's activating powers deep within. Yeah, Turning Chad, it. It, it, it is a leak. It's not actually celery. I know. There's a leak in the game. Yeah, there's the, three of the them, The dev should actually. fix that sometime. <laughs> I know. In in my head, there it's celery, but they are they are leaks. You are correct, chat. Uh, she saw me a whole lot sooner than normal. Bonk. All right, she's gonna go up that way. Uh... Nice. Yeah, so Thunder going up behind uh, the the shelving there uh, gets her like gets out of her line of sight, so she loses them. Doesn't always work, but it's Correct, a pretty yeah. pretty good for, uh, fallback if you get a little definitely yeah. a backup strat very yeah. useful when post game hundo some sometimes works sometimes doesn't work i do want to take this opportunity to say if you are in the audience and you run a co-op speed run feel free to reach out to me or you can also fill out the form that is going to be in chat soon from the dangerous command because I'm always looking for co-op speedrunners to be on my show. We can put together shows of the same genre. We've had like a beat em up show. We've had, we're gonna have a Zelda show coming up next month. So if you are a co-op speedrunner, you and your friends can submit to, to be on this show. And that's how uh, Thunder and Tass, Tass submitted to my form. And I was like, oh my gosh, I would love to have the goose on. So you will, also, if you run other speed games, you can go to gamesonquick.com slash hotfix and check out all the other shows that we have and submit there as well. This has been Last super fun. One. <laughs> Thank you for having us on. Yeah, absolutely. And, and I've been excited. Letting, 
let, letting us do silly goose things. I love silly things, so this is perfect. <laughs> Another uh, open question for everyone. What is your favorite song that the radios can play? Oh, we were actually just talking about this like right an hour before the run. We were, Thunder and I were talking about this earlier today. Uh, it's song four, which, the, the last song in the rotation of the radio. Which I don't, I don't, that doesn't actually help for anyone, but. <laughs> can you no, hum a few bars? I, nope, absolutely not. That is not happening. I tried. If we can find the radio afterwards, I would play it and pick it up. Uh, with a, with for me, a, a number one, the first song is the which is the Scottish like bagpipe song. Uh, that's that's my second favorite. Likewise, it'd probably be the first two for me, just because they're the ones I hear the most <laughs> for some particular reason. Should listen to four more. It's a it's a true banger. I'll need to constantly um, like regrab the uh, yeah. radio then. Uh, so chorus. We grab the two cores. Yeah, we need cores and so then we need won't like the windex or this. something. Is there yeah, we hers? still have a toothbrush. Um, we have we have toothbrush. We have two glass bottles, and we have uh, the, the cleaning fluid. I think. Right. Yep. And and the lid, the trash can lid. Right. Can't forget that. Oh, bro. come on. Bro, bro, sir. Okay. Don't forget, we also have the spade in the potato patch. You think? Uh, are we? You don't think the orange can is in? No, uh, if there's only one orange can, I thought we took it in right at the beginning. Um, orange can? The no, yellow. the orange can we took at the very beginning. The one that looks like was... Vegemite? Or no, no, the, the no, slightly more orange. No, that's the yellow and stuff. The, yeah. the orange can we took right at the beginning when we led um, Roger uh, when we read Willie in, uh, that was one of the two items that we took out. Was was the the orange can? We we can go and check uh, yeah. again going through, but we we definitely took it. It was it was right at the beginning. Oh well, yeah, just take a peek at the shelves. There's normally three cans plus a cleaning fluid and the price gun. Mm -hmm. So uh, I'll, I'll they are all gone. And, yeah, so it it's not there. I'm, I'm, I'm nearly positive. Can check the VOD. Um, that that was that we, that was it was one of the first two items that we took when we led when we led Willie um, in. We took the the orange can out. And if anyone wanted to check the VOD and confirm that, that would be fantastic. <laughs> That's the thing. It's like it's it's really great that we have a lot of people here helping us kind of keep track of everything because there's there's a lot of items to keep track of and. That's what the spreadsheet is. is for, but it's still, you know, not going to be once, perfect. Yeah. So <laughs> once once again, shout out to Leica and Space and Hit Marty yes. for doing the tracker for us. Absolutely. Uh, that's awesome. And, and to Leica for doing tracking many times on Goose All Items runs. Yes. Many times. That's awesome. Uh, and so. and also to the, the production studio who's keeping track of the counter as well. So it's really yes. awesome. Thank you so, so much. Yeah, it's a very important job. I this uh, category, I'd say it's always co-op because you do need someone to keep track of stuff. You you can track stuff yourself, but it's gonna it can get messy white, and take the time. The white blue jug from Back Garden. I oh. thought we got that. Uh, uh, we can double check in the the trash I, lake. I think it's it should be in the lake right now. It, it should be in the lake. Do you want to grab Keyword those? is should, and hopefully it is. Yeah, I, I that I don't remember if we put in the lake or not. I knew we took it. Yeah, we definitely put it in the house because it was one of the very last items we put into the house. Yep. Um, so it's either trapped in the house, it was left behind in the back, or we got it and it, it just happened to get missed uh, on the tracker. So we'll we'll clear it out, and if it's in the in the water, then great. Uh, okay, so 
Um, we are not going to put these items in yet. Why do I see it? I just saw a question no, mark. Go... Oh, was it the trowel? The trowel is still in there. there. No, uh, it was somewhere else. Oh, okay. Let's go. But we need that last um, empty bottle. Yes, and then so we, we need, do need that baby. empty bottle. Wait, where did you see? It was like there? right here, right there. Yeah. It's a carrot. Oh, oh, oh there's the carrot. Oh, the missing hey. carrot. Hey. All right, well, uh, let's get the empty bottle because we have to get that together. Good catch. Oh my Ooh, goodness. All right. You know, this is and a true cooperative trial. effort. It's the two runners, the commentator, host, and the 2,000 people in chat. So thank you all for. Yeah. <laughs> so fantastic. You. you know. <laughs> it's a it's a group effort. For this right. run, it truly it is. Not, is. It is not an individual. It is not just Goose and Tooth. It is everyone. Uh, grab the the trowel if you yeah. can. Uh, just make sure you avoid Willy. Can do. <laughs> Immediately get to see my Willy. The exact <laughs> opposite of avoiding him. Well, he was in the middle. <laughs> And now he doesn't care. He's going after his. He's going after the trowel now, even though he just had it in his hand. Yep. You he can tell that. his mind is broken. All right. Because... So trowel is now in, and <laughs> the final glass bottle. It is now finally in. We All still right. Need so to now grab it is time for the pushing of the items. Uh, let's quickly grab the brown meat real quick. Oh, and just at least get it in the water or oh, mm. do you want to try to get the cleaning fluid or uh, Jeremy plus um, yeah. try to uh, try to get cabbage? I can get Jeremy and cabbage. Try yeah, the, ca the cabbage is stuck. Is the Instantly thing. Is that, pushes is it, it up. Stuck? Does this look like <laughs> stuck? Hmm? Yes. Wow, this is really stuck. Yes. Yes, it does. Look how stuck this is. Actually, this is just being like zigzaggy. Cool. Good. All right, uh, orange oh, can God, is no. in. Oh, no. Are you, having, are you having some trouble? Do you need oh, some now help? it's stuck. <laughs> Fine. Just getting it over the lip. Over it. No. This is why caber percent is so fun. You should all try caber percent. Do it. It's fun. You get to score cabbage into a goal. Spoiler. I'm not joking. That's a, that's a real category and a real cool. thing. All right, so cabbage is in. Jeremy is in. Uh, and the orange can is in. So, okay, you're getting that. I need to find a yeah. plate then. Uh, oh, wait, man. newspaper. Or yeah, newspaper is already gone though. Well, yeah. There's there's one right there. Yep. Okay, so now it is time for oh, the gosh. pushing of the items. You're on the wrong side. Yeah, uh, I know. You, this corner is terrible. There, <laughs> what are you doing? Coming. This corner is terrible. God, I love it. Welcome to the chaos. Let's go. <laughs> and now the real run begins. Yes. Uh, so we'll we'll do this at least a little bit. Um, it's it's not easy, and obviously this doesn't work great. Um, I'm gonna un unwedge some stuff oh, this, from the uh, from that the reeds. Well. Yeah. So the everything gets caught in the in the reeds here. So we can get this stuff out, start pushing stuff. So uh, because we can move multiple items at once this way, um, as long as we don't keep pushing them back um, <laughs> uh, fine. in the process, uh, it's fine. It, uh, it, it, it winds up being worthwhile to move more than one item at once, uh, even if it's just a little bit. Uh, is there another item in there? No, nope, I don't think Quick so. Quick check. No question marks. Cool. Get some zoom in to make sure. Yeah, I didn't see anything. Uh, it, there's just it's just this corner and the pint glasses, Careful so I'm not touching glasses. them. Uh, we should do pint glasses uh, first. Good they... call. Gently pick one up. So okay, Ooh. and I, I there's a pint glass. That's a here. regular bottle. Uh, that's a there's bottle. one in front this, of the This is a pint bucket. glass. That's a pint glass. Nope, not that. That's yours. I'm trying to uh, grab it. Next problem. Uh, Hitboxes. Okay. Uh, so yeah, again, oh, pint glasses yeah. are the only items that can break. Once they are in the house, they are allowed to break. So we can just drop it. <laughs> it got home. All that matters. Uh, it is a three minute time penalty if a pint glass breaks before it gets home. There's one more in the corner. I'll grab it. Okay. 
Uh, Behind the little old lady. Okay, I will try to push more stuff then. Delightful. Look at that, doing work, pushing things with a pint glass. This man's gutsy. Okay. Uh, are we good or do we want to push more stuff? Uh, we can we can push a little bit more, like the the okay. very far stuff. We can get pushed in a little bit closer. Like once it's by like the lily pads and like this half, it's fine. Just like it's just this corner is like terrible. Yeah, if I can try to get up and around, I can try to push stuff down. There we go. That's that. that was pretty good. Look at that. Yeah, and the the current helped there too. So yeah, we're getting a, a lot of items closer, which uh, is good. Makes things faster. Okay. This is definitely not pollution. Just want to make that clear. All right, are we we're, good? Let's let's yep. start going. All right, we're trash lid and a plate. So this is gonna go really fast now. Uh, trash yep. lid and a plate. Lots of tracking. Yep. So we're gonna be calling all of this stuff out. Uh, draggables, grab the box, yep. uh, the the sign. Because uh, we also we do want to do draggables first, so that we can get all of them out of the way. Uh, so we have the the bigger of the the boxes, the blue and white box. Um, and the back garden Every, no goose sign. Yep. Back garden and pub box. Darn it. Uh, trying to it's fine. get it. Yeah. Good organization. Uh, okay, I'll tackle grab the box and the box. Oh, oh you grab the, okay, you're gonna grab the tackle box. I'm going to put this in here. Okay, we're not. Is it, is water? Hold it's on, uh, let me, I, I can put something in there though. Let yeah, me, uh, put let the me postcard do that. in there. Uh, so the postcard. Um, Maybe it's in yourself. there. Yeah, that's fine. And the other box. The tackle box. Yeah. The final box. Uh, are we almost done? We probably have another 20 to 25 minutes. Uh, uh drawer I have a mop and bucket. bucket. And, uh, yeah, grab whatever. Works. Okay, or grab the bucket. Yeah. Uh, uh, so we have the mop bucket and the regular bucket. Double bucket. I love it. I'm here for it. Uh, basically like we're in the NCAA tournament that's going on right now, right? Lots of buckets. That's a sports pun. Mm -hmm. sports. You get out. Yes. <laughs> It's always always the issue with these big draggables is like, can you get out? Uh, get the or I'll get the drawer. You get the shears that are right there. Okay, you get the shears. Fine. Uh, I well, I dragged the the pipe a little bit. <laughs> so yeah, that's the other thing. We get these draggables and we can start like you know pushing items a little bit too. There is a category for this. Yes, it's on the category extensions. Current world record is 249. Uh, uh, stool, picture. and there's a sign or whatever. Nope, that's. Can you grab, please? So we do have the pitcher. I know that oh, yeah. was okay. questioned earlier. Yeah, the blue no, you're right. Yeah, yeah. Pitcher. Good. That? Glad, glad that wasn't stuck in back garden. That would have been annoying. Okay, you, we do, I don't think you need to go that far. We have a ton of room here. We're in decent shape. Um, there's, uh, there's the trackable right there. Yeah, uh, I see the there's a, a parcel. That's a okay, I'll say there's a parcel uh, that I see up there. I'm just, I'm just still trying to move like more stuff up here and closer. It works, not complaining. Uh, so yeah, um, model bird bath and the traffic cone. You get sign. Uh, what? There's a parcel. The parcel. Oh, and I'll get the this. There we go. Trying to keep. Oh, I see the frog. Yep. Uh, so mini model bench and a parcel. 
I like how everything's gotten real quiet. This is <laughs> this is the in, the intense, intense focus focus part of the run. God, I'm just destroying everything. Goes Sorry. back to was, destroy more. I was trying to fix it, man. I'm trying <laughs> to fix it. All right, are you getting? Yeah, I'm getting frog. frog. Okay. Uh, so I have the the pub no pub goose no sign, goose. and we have the frog. Like I'm trying. There we go. That was that was better. That stuff's out of the way. Like the bench, that's the problem. Oh boy. Uh, yeah. yeah, it's fine. I don't think there's that many draggables. We do have the mm, mop no. still. I know the mop is a big one. Uh, that's out here somewhere. Uh, dart board. Cricket dart board. Dart. Yes. Damn it! I grabbed the dart. I, I'm so bad at. All right, I got the dart board. All right, I lost a dart though, so that'll be two darts that are out there. So I'm dragging the dart board plus one dart. I got the water pump from Model Village. So. Uh, yep. Yeah, one, one, one dart, dart is on there. Whatever, it's in there. <clears throat> oh, it made most of the way here, so that's honestly really good because it can be not that. Uh, oh, cricket bat and the uh, lawn chair. And then I see the other bench uh, is right there. But I know the mop is still somewhere. The mop is somewhere. I think it's uh, off to the left side, bottom left side. Um, I mean, we should also go up the um, the stream to see if anything got like caught. Caught on the yeah, way. Yeah, that's a good call. In the reeds, because uh, yep. that definitely happens sometimes. Yep, especially uh, like small things might make their way in there. Uh, and so again, reminder, if anyone hasn't been around for this, uh, recently, wait, no, no, up here. Uh, yep, yeah, so, yeah, okay, yeah, there. there's stuff here. Uh, the Thunder and I have never stuff. done this before. The coin, the coin always lands there. Like, it's yeah. programmed to flow over to the side. <laughs> so, yeah, Thunder and I have never done this before. Uh, this is only the second time this category has ever been run. Uh, Rikelt, who I know I saw in chat a little bit earlier, uh, he and I have done it once. But this is the first time Thunder has ever done it, and the first time that Thunder and I have done it together. Sorry. I'm trying to do soccer, but I don't know. If, I've never done uh, butt, butt soccer, soccer before. It's so it's actually really hard. I'm the, the soccer ball is being left. Uh, so we have the mop and the duck. We'll do soccer ball normally with like a non-draggable item. Duck. I don't know what other draggables we have. We should just start grabbing normal stuff. Yep. Okay. Toy uh, boat, sandwich it? half. Soccer ball is stuck. We need to get it and out from there. And blue woman. Well, okay, almost. so half a sandwich, toy boat, um, model blue lady. Cleaning uh, fluid. Cle yep, cleaning fluid and a sock. One sock. We're starting to really see the results of it now. Like uh, all pipe. of it coming together. Grab, thank you. Hat. You, old man's hat. Plus, I, I put the pipe in. All right, I'm going to try to get the soccer ball off here. Okay. Uh, I am going to try to do this. Okay. Uh, oh, badminton <laughs> is not the correct item to do that with. Do not do it with badminton. Uh, okay, so I have, uh, I don't know, one of the. Either pub, fl I, pub flower. I have that's, the pub flower. Uh, no, that's the chrysanthemum. That's a cri yeah, that's a chrysanthemum I, I, from Model Village. I, I'm, I'm Lily and chrysanthemum. The, so, the soccer. High Street and Model Village. Flowers. Oh, we also got the uh, phone booth door from Model Village and Timmy's and glasses. Timmy's Over glasses. Timmy. Yep. I, I, I'm going to try again on the soccer ball. I keep screwing this up. I'm going to start moving it. more items closer while you do that. Okay. Slow. Nope. I'm going slow. All right, I got it. I'm we're nope, nope, don't have right. it. There you go. Teamwork. Okay, we're good now. Uh, soap. That's one tomato and a soccer ball. Like good teamwork. List. Good teamwork. All right. Uh, I'm getting the badminton okay. racket. Uh, I'm getting a dart. Okay. That's a very dangerous one way. Dart. 
Hold a dart. Yes, it is. I mean, you don't put your darts uh, point first in your mouth <laughs> and run with them. Typically, put darts in my mouth at all. Don't know. Yeah, no. that, fair. Fair. Uh, never model, have, never will. model bench and one uh, boot. That should be a sock and tomato off to the left side. Yeah, I'm just trying to get something further away to because you were behind. No, 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 don't you go behind. Oh, he goes behind. <laughs> I was literally doing it so that you would catch up. A uh, uh, plate and a bra. We. Oui. All right. Okay. A glass bottle and a sock. Uh, and the empty bottle from the end of river, we definitely put that in the water. Yeah. We did that very, right at the beginning. A uh, paintbrush and a red ring. Uh, mini willy. And a dart. dart. And the other dart, so the last dart. Uh, once again, the, so the rule set, items have to be past the gate. That is the rule. I have the pacifier, and uh, Thunder has half of the vase. So we, there is still another half of the vase to go. Who is doing the tracking? Hit Marty and Leica in space. Shout outs to them. Amazing people. Uh, another tomato and one slipper. Also, uh, GDQ Tech, uh, I think Ray is doing the on-screen total items tracker uh, for that. So, independently, which also, thank you very much. Uh, green, ring, and the other slipper. Yeah, we have a ton of room for whatever draggables are still left. Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, flower. Yep, pub flower. Might be under Daisy, and then the tomato. Daisy and, tomato. and a tomato. Tomato from wherever a tomato hasn't been marked yet. There are a lot of tomatoes in this game. There's a lot. Uh, we have the ceramic thing from Back Garden. The potter, the plant, yeah, the small potters and the, the teacup. small potter and a teacup. Also from Back Garden. Uh, all right, I'm gonna get the the fishing lure from the okay. out to the pub bridge or area. And this is Rogers uh, glasses. These are Rogers, yeah. Dude, they're stylish, man. I like Rogers glasses. I would rock those. Just don't leave them on your patio table. That's true. Yeah. Uh, we have a red ribbon. Oh, we still need to get the blue ribbon, don't we? Uh, I think I dunked it somewhere in there. It's somewhere. <laughs> I okay. remember seeing it, but I don't necessarily remember where it is. So that was uh, red ribbon and the candlestick. I think it, the, it might have kind yeah, of there it is. There it is. Oh, there okay. it is, yeah. Uh, so blue, blue ribbon, ribbon, which is not on our tracker at all, but we've gotten it. Plus uh, a red ring. So that blue ribbon is the possible plus one if the count is off. Oh no, we 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 added it in. Okay. Uh, okay. I have the teapot. I Three. have a fork. Okay. So uh, I'm a little slow on the draggable, but that's fine. You can get a head start on things. I mean, in a pinch, uh, you can okay. stir your your tea with a okay, fork. There we go. Oh, all right. What went with Roger's glasses? I I have no idea. <laughs> uh. Cr cricket ball and a red ring. You just you're just dropping stuff right in the middle now. <laughs> we got room. I that is hubris speaking, sir. <laughs> uh, okay, we have the piece of wood from the model village and another green ring. Yeah, the wood from the bell tower. I I. Whatever cleaning it's called. Up, cleaning up your mess. 
It's our mess. Yo, F George. Yo, shout out to George. Yes, George made the tracker that we're using, actually. So thank you, as always, to George for his tracker. Uh, we have the pepper shaker and the miniature uh, police officer. Male person, it might be. Postal or, carrier. Or the male per postal there carrier. They have, they're, a they're they have a uniform. They probably have a badge. Uh, all right, I have the other half of the vase, so the vase will be fully in. I got model Timmy. Yeah, the on-screen display is not being used. Um, there you go, model. Uh, yeah, little Timmy, model Timmy, and the the vase is now fully in. Uh, it's right, a lot of tomatoes. Stuff. You went. You, you didn't grab. Oh, you didn't. No, you got a cork. I was like, I, 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 was like I saw you just whip. Pork and a tomato. Stop. I'm gonna go for the little old lady, grandma. All right. Uh, Probably grab the tomato. A yep, tomato. Another tomato. So those are both draggables up there. Uh, so we can grab those next. Got it. Yep. Of course, George. Tear down nicely. Oh my God. Very gingerly. <laughs> you gotta be. You have to be <clears throat> cautious. She's an old Burr. lady. Our babushka. Yes, of course. We have to treat her with care. Mm -hmm. right. Oh, yours is not draggable, apparently. No, it's not draggable. Uh, I'll just Mine's... try to Good. scoot this. Doink, doink. All right. Okay. Uh, so we have, we have the uh, the art easel thing and the mailbox, mailbox. mailbox. from yep. model, both from Model Village. <clears throat> uh, and there's not too many items left, apparently. Uh, just that one tomato. Tomato one uh, of a billion. Yeah, and I think I have a knife. You can't tell have... if I have a knife or a fork. Peace was never an option. <laughs> It's oh, a fork. fork. It's a fork. I couldn't. I couldn't see sideways. A goose with a fork is still dangerous. I would stab somebody if I was a goose with a fork. Just but piercing I'm not damage. A goose with, I'm not a goose, and I do not have a fork, so I would not stab anybody. You if heard that it is here, wrong. folks. Okay. Tass does not have knife. a fork, and therefore eats food with his fingers or a spoon. <laughs> Spoons are. I just important. have a knife, and I just like stab into it. Uh, mm. Tomato and a knife. Definitely not a fork this time. No, no, no. We're we're getting there. We're closing in on the items. It's almost there. Getting we're almost close. done. Yeah. When we get down to when we get down to ten, though, it would be great if chat did a countdown. Oh, with us. we totally should do a countdown. We're getting there. So, chat, I hope you're ready. Count on the number of Last items. Last step, harmonica until it's gone. So we have another knife and a harmonica. The fun part will be if we don't know where one item is and chat will be that stuck is, at one or two. That is, for like that is not minutes. fun. That is not fun at all. Actually. Uh, it's fun for me. It's entertaining right. for me. I would it encourage. is entertaining. Uh, model. I have the model shovel. I have a tomato. And another tomato. And that napkin has been sitting in this canal for an hour and a half, two hours now. How much starch did she put in that thing? Uh, oh yeah, we haven't taken that, that yet. Quite a bit. Okay. Uh, ooh, we're actually, first time, two tomatoes. Like peas in a pod, they just match. Nice two napkin push. Two tomatoes. Motto. Yeah, we actually uh, we went overboard with how much room we needed on the, the draggables. <laughs> See? We were overly cautious. Is there anything else over there? No, that's it. Okay. Uh, uh, nothing else money. over there, I don't think. A little, little penny going. hiding under the old man. Yep. Tomato and model old man. Uh, we are, oh, we are down. We are under 10 items. Yep, uh, chat's, to go, chat's I think. counting. They're going. Fantastic. Thank oh, you yeah. so much, chat. Uh, let's go. I'm a big fan of this. We do the same thing in Celeste when we get to the summit. We, everyone's counting the flags. Oh, yeah, with all the berry? Yeah, all, all, all the, the flags. flags yeah, the yeah. End, yeah. Rose, and we have, uh, Willie's Jeff Cap. Uh, 
that tomato is trying to escape. And of course, if we get down to one, be sure to give us a heads up on time point. as well. It's looking uh, good. Grab the ring. There we go. Ring. Okay. Yep. Uh, wait. Where's the lily? It's already. The in. lily was already it's in already there. In. It is. Yes. Yeah. So when I, I carried I, it I in. Saw, he carried it in the same time you brought in a different flower. I think it was the soccer. Yeah, you're dealing with the soccer ball. Oh, okay. Uh, because it's not marked on the sheet. Washcloth. I, uh, so we do have one. We should have one item left. I think we um, have two. The cork was in. Then. Little old. Uh, oh, we have two items left. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we uh, have two items check left. Upstream. No, I know what the two items are. Oh yeah. Yep. So yep. These are the officially final two, two items left. Two. Oh my gosh, yo! And we know what they are. No items missed. No penalty either. No penalty. Yeah, yeah that's great. Can we get the sub 240? So everyone's about to see why we save Bill for last. Yeah. This is this changes the entire world quite literally. All right, Bill and Minnie, here we go. Even even the music changed, as you can hear. Oh, we have music again! Yay! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So yeah, so that open that gate that was just open, not open anymore. Yep. And locked. So oh, really, that didn't work. Okay. All right, nice clip. Uh oh. Yeah, uh, if, they, if they touch the bell, they'd have to drag all that those heavy items from the... I'm uh, your... I hope this works. Yeah, because if you can't clip that through, you're going to have to back We have to go around. Bell. Okay, oh, you got oh, there it. Cool. Is, there it is. Like, we were just okay. very, 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 very tight. We have to go around and do the whole bell return. But we're <laughs> no. free. We're free. Let's go. Let's go. The last yeah. two items. Get ready on time. Yeah. yeah uh, time is coming now. All time. right. Wow. So let's. Uh, can, can we, you want to get the photo in here? On top of all of our items. <laughs> oh, you just <laughs> got them in the box. <laughs> box. <laughs> now go get crowned. <laughs> Wait, it, we can't. There's no way we're gonna get the the crown out. Oh. oh. Well, so our final time was 239.28. You did nice. it. Let's go. Got the sub 240 and world record. That is that is a new world record. Congratulations. Congratulations. It's only the second run that's ever been done, but still, uh, it was better than the first run that was ever done. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta get a green. <laughs> yes, I already absolutely. got my screen. Yeah, get your good screen cap. Everything. Oh, everyone, I, I see the claps and honks already in the chat, but that was awesome. I hope you all enjoyed. I definitely did. Yeah, good zoom. Yep. Yep. There we go. Uh, real quick, is is there time to show off uh, another 10 minute uh, chaos cabbage? I thing? think we will go to break screen and figure that out but you know first uh be sure to uh give give some shout outs and all that good stuff before before we do that so go right ahead uh sure yes yeah. shout outs to uh Leica and hit marty uh to ritz on comms thunder thank you for always riding shoddy with me Thank you for tolerating uh, me. And, and all of the Goose community uh, for for figuring out and, and doing all the, the these silly Goose things. Awesome. That's all I Fantastic. Go ahead, Thunder. Yeah, huge shout outs to the Goose community. Um, been going on two years now with you guys. It's just absolutely mind boggling. It has just been fun all the way. I I greatly enjoy it. You guys are awesome. And I'm sure you all will continue to be awesome. And Ritz, anything you'd like to say? Thanks for uh, having me on the, the comms for this. This was delightful. I forgot all about some of the, the fun little nuances of this run. Um, looking forward to uh, seeing everybody at SGDQ this year. 
Absolutely, yes. All the information about SGDQ is on the Games Done Quick website. So, I have received word we do have time for our fun little bonus run. So, we are going to head to the break screen so everyone stretch, get some water. That was a long run. Uh, but don't go <laughs> anywhere because we're going to still see some more goose chaos real soon and so just a reminder that your subs gift subs prime gaming and all of the bits help support our weekly hotfix content please consider supporting our daily shows by subscribing if you enjoy hotfix so we're going to take a break but stick around for more chaotic goose action Hello all, welcome back to It's Dangerous to Go Alone, a celebration of cooperative speedruns. We just saw a fantastic new world record in Untitled Goose Game All Items, and we're gonna see a bit of a victory lap run. Before we jump into that, I am going to be posting the links to both Talsfoot and Thunder's Twitches. Please give them a follow if you enjoyed this run and you wanna see more goose shenanigans. Additionally, if you enjoyed Frost Fatales that happened last month, on March 26th and 27th, we're going to have the Frame Fatales Game of the Month celebration here on Hotfix. And you can go to gamesdonequick.com slash framefatales for more information about the all-women speedrunning group, or if you're a woman in the audience and would like to join our community, you can get information on that. So yeah, we are ready for more goose shenanigans. So I'm going to pass it back off to Tasselfoot, Thundar, and Ritz Blues. What are we going to see yeah. here? Yeah. What are we going to see here? Uh, this is called Haber Percent. Uh, and what it is, is we score a soccer goal with the cabbage. So that is a portmanteau of uh, cabbage and soccer for Caber Percent. Um, it, is, uh, it is very silly, but it is a celebration that Thunder and I do every time we get a new PB in co-op. So... Uh, chat, you got to help and be part of a, another PB for us, and you get to be part of the celebration as well. So we will get started with the co-op Haber percent. Uh, and so I guess just to give a little bit about it. Oh, but is, that's time, right? Oh, yes, the hop is time, sorry. <laughs> yep. it's, it's not really that serious of a run, so uh, we're not too concerned about I, it. But I have yeah. a concern. If, if you is, if you get a PP on caber percent in co-op, do you have to do another caber run? Yes. Uh, yeah. But we're not going to, so no. it's fine. <laughs> um, it won't happen. Because uh, we did one yesterday, because we actually got a PB in 100%, uh, but we completely forget what the route is. So, you know, <laughs> this, is, this is just... Uh, maybe we'll remember better today. But so basically... Oh, yeah, I have to turn the water off. Uh, so this is going to start off as basically just co-op um, any percent, but with go, 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 glitches. Go, go, go. I, I remembered with glitches. Uh, there will be a little a little bit of glitches um, for the first three areas of the game because we need to open up access to the soccer goal, um, and so that's important. And then we have to get the cabbage. Oh, that was oh that was bad. That was very bad hat placement. Okay, uh, it's fine. I'm stuck. Not not as fine. Uh, do I need an item or anything? What am I doing? No, you don't. Nope, I don't need no, an you're item. Not, yeah, you're not doing uh, garden. I'm just hanging sweat. out. Yep. I'm hanging out. I'm, I'm spinning. All right. Yeah. He should go to his final task now, I think. Do we want to move the After cabbage? After he gets or... his, his hat. Oh, yeah, we should move the cabbage. See, I don't know Keep what we're doing. On. I don't know what's happening. This is chaos uh, on chaos, and it's beautiful. 
you know, stuff's happening. I, I, so this is the side hole. Uh, we never actually used it in the hundred percent run. Uh, oh, you, I got on, I was on top of you. Uh, I'm stuck, dude. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna miss the cycle, but it's fine. Yep, there we did. I heard it. Yeah, <laughs> you because you you went in and then I wound up getting on top of you. Uh, so okay. So anyway, so we have the cabbage there. Uh, will we do double cabbage for the people? I don't know. You want to do double cabbage? Oh, this is gonna be rough, but yes. That is sure. a yes that very Let's much sounded like a no. <laughs> Sure. Usually we, we can do yeah. double cabbage. Why not? Let's do double cabbage. Let's do something new. You're out of range, dude. I don't, yeah, you were standing too far. Uh, <laughs> why not? Why not try something that we've never done before? Why Again. not have more Again. chaos? <laughs> yeah. What's, what's doing more stuff that we've never done? You gotta be, be the first time, right? <laughs> Uh, okay, yeah, so uh, we did get a PB the first time. Obviously, we'll get okay, bad RNG here, so we can't break the broom. Uh, we get out of the shop when doing this uh, because it, it sets up the shopkeeper correctly, and then it also um, gets her to de aggro on us later because she already knows that we left. She saw that. Um, and the same way the shop is, is light gray, uh, the range of the TV shop owner is also light gray, so that's why I stand outside of that range to begin with. Uh, you gotta break the broom. He's in the way, so I'm going around. Uh, that's a bad idea because of aggroing. Okay. Are you grabbing an item? Uh, yeah. Okay. So we're, we're taking two items with us. Um, uh, excuse me? Lady? Ma'am? Okay. I got it. Uh, Thank you. All right. Yeah. So again, locking her in. But so we're not doing any of like the extra stuff that we had to do in hundred percent. We're we're doing the bare minimum here. Yep. Glitchless. Yeah. The thing is with any percent, um, doing any percent glitchless and a category we call all final tasks, which is basically any percent glitchless but glitches, uh, are still really really similar. There actually are not many glitches in what would be an any percent glitchless category. What category is this? It is caber percent. We are scoring. Well, actually, this is now double double caber percent. Caber apparently. Caber percent. Yep. Yeah, uh, I'm going to bump. OK. Uh, do I, do I want to give? Yeah, we want to give him items. And then are you clipping? Yeah, I'm clipping. Yeah. Uh, okay, that wasn't great. Okay. The hat. Okay, that's fine. Uh, and then classes, we still need. No, no, the, or, the, no the finders, finders are good. So you got two. You don't three need that already. either. You don't need that either. Lily. All you need is the hat clip. And All you're we done. needed was the hat. See, we, it's been a while since we've done this. All right. Well, Tina's cooperating, so that's good. Uh, Roger's gonna be off cycle. Me. Uh, because of me picking that up. It's fine. Uh, no, we don't do goose yet, right? Thank you. She saw you, no. she saw you. But no, what about the... Damn it. Oh, you were That's... too close. What about that? Why didn't she put that on? She should have still put she that saw on. you at the last possible moment. Weird. She's being rude. Uh, she was being very rude. Yeah. Uh, yeah, normal, because normally the, that the flower should have been a higher priority. That's why I was confused. Okay. Now we can move this. Uh, you can just hang out on the other or yeah. side or something. Okay, so we need her to pull that back up and then I can lead her down. So yeah, this is like very similar to what a co-op any percent glitchless would look like. For now, it it will it will take a hard right turn very soon. Uh, we already did that. All right. right, but heck, and then I'm grabbing this. Uh, don't need the other slipper, right? I like you so far. 
Yep. We're going for slipper now. Ah, slipper, yeah, slipper and okay. pause. Any percent. Right. It's been so long. It has been so long. My cabbages. My cabbages. All right, there we go. I'm gonna keep the ribbon. Uh, you know, so that we can we can stay fancy and free. Uh, I'm gonna open that again. Nope, didn't want to grab that. Okay. Uh, this should work out timing wise. Just about. Although, yeah, oh it's wait. Fine. Oh, I didn't grab. We didn't grab a sock. Clinch. We forgot the sock. Uh. Okay. So, do you want to go and grab the sock, and then I will. Yeah. And you can actually exit the other way uh, with the yeah, sock you can instead clip, of. Yeah, you can clip to the left once she Not leaves. with her. <laughs> yeah, you need her to to leave. Yeah, I think I'm fine. You I'm, just have to I'm, stop I'm, grabbing it, dude. Wait for her to go, or you can clip out here. Yeah, I can clip out here. That, I'm over here. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were gonna clip out on the on the left up here. No, you were not with her right there. Here, yeah. okay. Yeah, we don't need any of these items anymore, so we are yeah. we are done with them. And now, so Tina will open up the soccer area for us, and we are now good to uh, double double cabbage. Apparently, incredible. Pass. Why? Uh, oh, he he put it back. Okay. Yeah, of course. Um, okay. Okay, thank you. Uh, please. Gosh, you guys, you guys look like you're struggling. Uh, go in the hole, uh, and and then I'm I went on top of it. Of Come course on, cabbage. I did. No, it was fine. And then, uh, uh, okay, we're there. This, all right. I, I got mine. I'm good. All right, see ya. I'm out. <laughs> Come on, I can't thunder. see anything. <laughs> cabbage, where are you? Where you're am I? Uh, oh, make sure oh, your okay, head is down. Fine. Make sure your yeah. head's down when you're like pushing it, and don't run. There we okay, go. There we go. There we go. All right, you're, we're free. All right. Oh my <laughs> god. No. We're free. Pushes it the wrong way. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, buddy. I believe Th Thunder A has lag again. Thunder is playing through Parsec, uh, remoted into my desktop. So Thunder has lag, and Thunder isn't usually the one that does this. So. Uh, you don't really usually have much a, practice. Usually it's a team effort when it's co-op. Well, but like, in co-op 100%, we push the cabbage, and I'm the one that always does that. That's so true. So, I have significantly more cabbage pushing experience. Which, you might think, hey, this doesn't seem that hard, uh, in which it's case hard. you would be wrong. Because the cabbage has a mind of its own. Uh, I mentioned it during the all items portion, but just to reiterate, um, what makes the cabbage so difficult to push is the fact that its hitbox is made up of a combination of both a cube and a sphere. So sometimes it rolls nicely and normally, and other times it will just hit an edge of that square or the cube and just go off at an angle for no reason at all. And you can't peck it like you can a soccer ball. So if it yep. gets stuck, you just kind of have, have to, to lever it until it goes the way you want. Yep, you kind of neck it a bit and body it. No, oh, why? Cabbage, stop. Yeah, here's so the also, best also, part. Yeah, well, this is uphill, by the way. Um, so normally when we do this <sighs> as like one cabbage, uh, we work together and like, one person is a backstop, and the other person... No. <laughs> All right, mine's up there. Do you need some help, or you got this? Yeah. There was a you point want... where I was about to overtake you, and then you got in the way. All right, I'll help. I'm helping, I promise. All right, so oh now God, we also want to get Roger... We want to get Roger out here, because he will uh, pick up the cabbages. Ooh! Oh, no, almost. You ruined it. How dare you? <laughs> All right, we got him. No, not the ribbon. The the ribbon getting in the way. All right, it's fine. He'll get. He'll see both cabbages, and he will pull, pull uh, throw them over for us. So that is one of the nice things. We don't have to push it all the way through ourselves. No, this is not a real category, Leica. We are not doing another percent after this. This is the end. This is the last this run. Is, yes. GDQ is gonna kick us off no matter what anyway. I can't handle that, this is... I can't handle more goose. It's been too many. 
There's been a lot of goose. Uh, and yeah, this is uh, this is this is what the people asked for. So we are we are just conduits uh, of entertainment for the people. That is. See, there you go. That's Aww. why with the ribbon. That's why you can't go that way um, during the hundred percent. You have to clip out. No more uh, fancy because, goose. Because the ribbon is automatically lost to oh, it. No. Uh, oh which no. Which is intentional, oh, no. which is Alright, we nice. got one in. Which is why it's a hidden task. If it was uh if that wasn't there and it was just easy, uh then it wouldn't be worth it. Alright, time is coming up. No uh, when when Thunder can cross the <laughs> come line. Come on, come on, you got this! Come on! Cabbage, get in and, and go! Uh, time. Finish. Woo! Nice. Yay. All right. Good assist. Let's go. Double cab. Double cabbage. First ever. Never been done before. Wow. And wow. Well, this is a historic <laughs> day in the goose Place community. Place the cabbage. Wow. So that's a Place. PB. So that means you guys have to do another caber run because you guys nope. got a, a PB <laughs> on cabber. Nope. 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 <laughs> <laughs> well done. <laughs> So we don't we don't call that a goal, by the way. We call that a coal, C O A L. Oh, it is a cabbage no. goal. Understood. Understood. Yes. So, coal. <laughs> so yeah. And if you push uh, it all the way through the the net, you get coal's law. <laughs> oh my goodness! Oh my god! <laughs> and with that, thank you so much for having us. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Well, that was a fantastic run. I put again in the chat, please follow Toss Foot and Thunder. That was a fantastic, amazing showcase. And Ritz Blues, thank you for the commentary as well. If you enjoyed this show, if you enjoyed It's Dangerous to Go Alone again, and you can submit your own runs to this show. I just put the command in the chat. And you also can go to gamesdonequick.com slash hotfix to see all of the incredible shows we have on Hotfix. We don't just do ha we don't just have AGQ and SGDQ. We're doing speedrun content all the time. So please, thank you for tuning in today and keep checking out our fantastic shows. So speaking of other shows we have tomorrow at 7 p.m. Eastern, we have Awfully Silly, which is a show about awful and silly games, followed by That's Never Happened Before, which is a show talking about glitchy speedruns and how the glitches work. It's a really fantastic time. And so you also can catch up on all of our amazing hotfix shows at YouTube. Just find Games Unquick on YouTube and you see the VODs of all of the shows. If you came in halfway through this and you want to see the rest of the run, you can go there. But for now, that's all we have today on GDQ Hotfix. Stick around for the raid and we'll see you tomorrow at 7. Thank you so much, everyone. And Honk, honk. of course. <laughs> honk. Honk.